Hello, hello. We're back again. Together again. In one room. Yes. At Casa La Jack. Yeah, the, uh, the park of Heather. If you notice a little whirring, that's Jack's tower. <laughs> that's awesome fan, and yeah. there's not a lot we can do about yeah. that. If you don't notice it, great. Also rocking the one monitor setup, so let us switch over to here. We can still see chat. It's just going to be on the laptop. Yeah. I don't right. have two monitors I've got my laptop over here. I should fix that. I should get two monitors. Yeah. Yeah, so I can have something full screen going on, and then I can watch something. Not wrestling. I'm done with that for a while. There we go. Yeah, some bad stuff is coming out about wrestling. I don't want to talk about that right now. It's, we're, we're here together again. And we're, we got uh, planning to do two streams this weekend, starting yeah. with... Mario Maker because I have made a super world over my time yes. over your time away. well bas basically being a bus aide I've mentioned this on my Mario Maker streams is that uh, I, I got downgraded from driver to bus aide same pay not a problem yeah so I just had time r uh, riding the bus and I made a bunch of Mario Maker levels awesome I'll try to keep my anger in check for my parents' sake. <laughs> Do we have that? We're gonna have to like tweak the volume manually if we want to tweak it, aren't we? Yeah. Can you, don't, you don't have a remote. Wait, that's probably fine. I think it's good, good volume. Think it's fine. Yeah. Hope you're right. Do you think it's too loud? I uh, no, I, I thought it was too quiet for a second. Oh, this is this has got some weight to it. That's the Pro Controller. I got one of those because the Joy Cons broke. <laughs> Oh, really? Uh, a, drift, and B, they just... Do you remember that thing that happened sometimes where they would just disconnect spontaneously? I... maybe? Maybe it didn't happen when, when you were around. It just got worse and worse. Oh, that's... that's... Here, let me, let me navigate. <laughs> hey, we're connected. I got new notifications. It's a base player love. Spleen! I don't want to... Uh, that's no, no, that's, that's fine. I, I actually, uh, so I finished the Super World. The Super World is designed to be mostly easy stuff. Cool. In fact, there are multiple difficulty routes throughout the world. Oh, I'll play and through them all. After I finished that, I still had some time riding the bus. So, I continued making some more levels. And those ones are harder. Those ones are not in the Super World. We don't need to worry about those. <laughs> God, Peach just looks terrified on the, in the Super Worlds. That's right. We got the little su the Super Worlds mode. Uh, yeah, yeah. Last time we played this was the did the Ninja speedruns exist? I think they did. Yeah. Something I real I noticed is that this TV it seems to be showing everything. Oh yeah, this one doesn't bleed off like yeah. all of ours did. <laughs> so I got the good one. I'm sorry. Play together. It's okay. I'm just gonna, I'm gonna let Jack play this alone because it's not designed for multiple Super players. Super fourth seat world. It's oh, gonna break some worlds if people do it together. Yeah. Four. What was that supposed to be for? Four. I don't know. Maybe that's the number of people who've played it. Oh. Uh, Are we just gonna see a few numbers for the first world and then everyone just stopped after one? Ninja speeder. Mushroom planes. This could be all flat. Uh, oh. What? Jack, we're on your channel. I told you we should have... <laughs> we didn't do the, the Twitch key. I, I was telling you about it, you're like... <laughs> I, didn't, <laughs> I didn't say nothing. She didn't say nothing, well, that's the problem. She... Yeah, give oh, me it's moment. always my fault, Jack. I mean, should we just keep going? <laughs> that's fine, I guess, right? <laughs> Doing we something got the weird. Video. Who cares? Well, welcome to my channel. I'll oh, post shoot. it. I'll post it on the. Uh, I'll post it on the Discord. Yeah. We'll just we'll just upload this to YouTube later. Right. Oh, that's gonna be bizarre because we're showing the fourth C channel chat on the screen. Oh God! You're right. Shit. We gotta switch it. I guess we could uh, we could con continue recording but stop streaming. Yeah. Give me a sec. Okay. I'm gonna I'm swap. <laughs> Technical difficulties. Technical mistake, more like. The difficulty is if... Oh. Did, did that not... Oh, come on. You're hitting the second from the top. Yeah, I know. I was, I hope, I was hoping I could do it faster. Alright. So we logged into Twitch on OBS. Yeah, we? we just we just didn't... Uh, we just didn't uh, set the stream key. See? Look at this. Connect account. Recommended. Yeah, we can just do that, can't we? Sure. Log in. Here. Yeah, go for it. Wah. 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 
<laughs> we need to. Uh, how come Wario's not in Mario Maker? Oh. Yeah, no. We got it. We got. We got the Toads. We got Toad One and Toad Two. Isn't that good enough for you? Yeah. No. All, all Toads all the time. Oh, a new Paper Mario was announced. You see that? Yeah, the Origami Wars or whatever the fuck it is. All right, start it up again. All right. Hit OK. And start streaming. Oh, hey. There it is. That's bizarre. That's Why? how that's how you uh <laughs> it, save, it saves the settings by Twitch account. Odd. All right, hit start streaming. Yeah, I know. Give me a second. I'm I'm taking a swig of uh you're not allowed to drink. Of my professor pepper. All right. All right, we're, we're now back. on uh, fourth seat. Yes. Fourth seat this is going to be weird for people. Yeah. Yeah. Uh What are you, what are you doing? I don't know. I I need to change the okay, TV. Go for it. This is, this is this is a little bit complicated. Doing this in a whole new setup. This is, this is a false start. All right. That's okay. All right. It didn't take We're back. Long. Super fourth seat world. I can't do that. Fifty coins. How do I get that? I did. I did try to design these like Mario levels. And this is. I think this has been more or less the most popular level of them. Proving that people just want easy levels. Yeah, easy creative levels. I was trying to. Oh, once you're once you're in, you're locked, and you can't go back and do another. That's funny. It also gives more uh, more use for coins. For collecting coins. Yeah. So the thing with a lot of the old levels is that those were designed for uh, the endless challenge. Yeah. Which where you have the the three lives limit. So there's no point in having more than that in your level. Hmm. Wait, how am I... It's rip. Alright, well, let's continue. Whereas uh, this mode, you have lives that carry over across the whole campaign, but at the same time, there's not really a penalty for game over. You uh, don't lose your world progress. You oh, just, that sucks. You lose checkpoints. I love if like it was hardcore like that, but I guess not. You don't have to end your whole game, but it would it would be nice if it at least set the reset the single world. What up? Something. Something would be better than nothing. Whew. All right, first course clear after an embarrassing. Hello, Darian. Day. We're doing good. How are you We're doing? We're in good. a room together again. Yes, finally for the first time in a while. Last of Us 2 ain't doing so hot. <laughs> oh no, what happened? Almost every video on it has been like an 80% dislike ratio. Why? Um, that's a good question. I don't know much about Last of Us 2. It was, uh, I, someone showed an image, it might have been Darian, of like, like, 5 out of 5, 10 out of 10 reviews from every single game publication. And it like raised a red flag, like, no, no game is this perfect. <laughs> <laughs> And then uh, I think someone else posted a shot nice. of uh, like, like apparently Last of Us Two has a fully like fully modeled topless sex scene, very explicit. Ooh, how how raunchy! I, I assume it doesn't show genitalia, but uh, you it, never it, know. It shows you know nip nips, and uh, contrast that with all all the anime titty games that Sony doesn't allow. Oh, <laughs> so people are people are kind of raising flags about that. <laughs> it's 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 okay because it's not Japanese. Yeah. That's that's what the it's autistic. It's bold. <laughs> I don't know if it's eighty percent dis. I don't know if that's enough for an eighty percent dislike. I have no idea. There's got to be something else going on. That's I, happening. I got it. Well, you, I'm playing. You're the one who's on research duty. Oh, I just had a conversation with yeah. Darian. Darian can talk about it. Darian, talk about it. Tell us what's uh, what's going on with Last of Us 2. Also, hello, Sandy. Hey, Sandy. Someday, someday we'll be in a room together as well. Alright, cool. I didn't fuck it up that time. These are well-designed worlds. Thank you. Straightforward. I, I went for a, a traditional, like, Mario levels for the most part, and went for a... Uh, Kind of one gimmick piece per level. Obviously, this is the donuts level. Ah, uh, the Donkey Kong method. Yeah. I like that. I mentioned uh, before Damn. we started, I did the Donkey Kong randomizer, which was very difficult. Yeah, I saw some of it. It was 
it was weird because you mentioned that uh, that the levels are supposed to just go segue one into the other and not. I wonder if that was an option that that needed to be checked or well, something. It, it was. I used the wrong randomizer. Apparently, there are two. <laughs> there's a there's one that just randomizes enemies. And that's, I think, an earlier version. So I did that first uh, because it had a later version number. I thought that was the, the latest one. Ah, uh, and it wasn't? Uh, no, there was the exit randomizer is a different program. So like 15 minutes in, I swapped over and had to make one of those. I, I missed that. I gotta... You've created an abomination. I don't know why anyone would want to bomb in their nation, but... A bomb in there. So it's worth note. I also, in terms of the overworlds for each of these... Yeah. I did uh, their branching paths. Oh uh, yeah, and with uh, two new easier levels, or you can take the shorter route, which is one harder level. Usually one of my old ones. <laughs> nice remixing. Fourth C. Everyone loves water levels. So what's the storyline behind this Mario Quest? Most people don't play games for story. You didn't even think about it. You don't have you don't have epic lore. No. Damn. I played Bacon Bombs World, which is. Super Grand Pere World. Super Grand Pere. And is about his French grandfather, O.C. O.C.? Original character, Don't Steal? Yeah. Gotta, gotta be honest, I had some trouble following the story. <laughs> That's the best kind of story you had. No, there's not, uh... Oh, there's not dialogue boxes, there's not NPC toads. Mario Maker's not really story conducive. Uh, ROM hacks, uh, if you want an in-depth experience, ROM hacks are still the way to go, but if you want something casual, just I just want to play some new Mario le levels, man, this is the way to go. There are some disappointments I've had with the, the Super World update, namely that uh, power-ups don't carry over between levels of the same type. I've, I've noticed. Which would be really, it would open a lot of cool doors, like if you manage to smuggle a Fire Flower in the next level, you get a little bonus or something. Yeah. And it, granted, it would have to be the same style, it would have to be another Mario World level, or one with a Fire Flower, but... And that's okay, they can do that. I'm guessing it's just like to be some kind of flag they didn't want to set and they don't want to. I'm sure they either didn't think about it or they thought about it and there's a reason why they didn't want to implement it. Well, I'm sure they figured it would break a lot of levels. Yeah. Which I say is the creator of the world's fault. That's up to them, <laughs> that's up to, them to make sure that that's working. <laughs> Especially if they're doing like. So that was just a standard uh, water level, multiplayer versus. Oh, there was a massive uh, plot leak. Oh, was there? Is that why there? That uh... and uh, I spoiler spoiler alert. Mute for like five seconds if you want. Yeah. According to Darian, like a major character gets killed off by some rando newbie at a left field. <laughs> Welcome back. <laughs> That would piss me off, too, if, like, Kimpachi just got... <laughs> anyway, thanks for the warm-ups. Uh, this, you, you played this one, right? Have I? Well, I'll play it this, again. This was an old level. Oh, this was the climbing level. To scale that cliff. Yes. That would be good to do this level again. More, with more experience. And, uh... It's windy today. Yeah. It's Seattle. Seattle is a different, uh, has a different weather system than Battleground, in my opinion. Battleground was basically Oregon weather, and Oregon weather was fucking crazy. Sweet. Just by a river basin. Hey. Rockin', I got it. I got this. I'm okay. Oh, oops. <laughs> That's why I... Oh no, you gotta fall further before they'll respawn. Yeah, that's right. Thank you, speedrun Mario. <laughs> speedrun to death. Well, the good news is I can just farm one-ups here indefinitely. Yeah, that's uh, kind of an oversight. Because I made these levels, the old levels, with endless challenges. Yeah, which is like you can only put uh, get three one-ups at a time. My logic for those has always been just give them three three one-ups at the start. If they get through the level in less than three lives, then they've earned the profit. Well, you know what? That's your fault. You should have thought of that before putting this level in here. Oh, no. It's just, it's just... <laughs> you want me to take down and republish all my old levels? No. It's done is done. It also, there we I, go. Checkpoint. 
I've watched, uh, I think three people stream this, stream this Super World. Oh, wait, people stream this Super World? Uh, Trog, Wickersham, and Sandy oh, all sweet. streamed it. Cool, what did they think of it? Uh, I, I, I think they mostly liked it. Oh yeah, that's right, this is how I, yeah. And I had to, uh, I, I revised some things over time. But, uh, never before seen on this stream. Okay, cool. So this is an older level, which means... Which means that it doesn't have the, uh... The... The old stuff added in the newer update. Yeah. Alright, well... And I also, with the levels made specifically for this super world, I, uh... I did them very formulaically. Shit. Like, each one has, uh, three hidden 50 coins. Shit! And exactly 50 regular coins. <laughs> you, you really... Well, so if you get every single coin and you get, and you get the ending banner, you get three lives. Damn fucking hell! <laughs> I don't remember this being this difficult. This is probably the hardest part of the level. Yeah. Oh, and, uh... There we go. What was the tangent I was on? Was that, uh... They, they, uh, a few people played this world, and they, all, all of them did run out of lives at some point, so the, it was at least, it got Damn. difficult enough by the end Damn. to be a challenge. And he respawned. Fine. Whatever. <sighs> I probably isn't worth playing levels that you do recognize, just because there's a lot of levels in this campaign. Can I exit course without, yeah. alright. No, you get an instant game over. Mario EXE pops out. That's why you put it as a castle, because that's the hard one. Yeah. So, are the uh, end of world stuff still the same, or... End of world stuff? Like, is this a level you, you had before, or is this a remix level? No, that's new. Oh! Wait, what? Okay. Ignore that! Uh... So, I guess because we're the maker of the world, we can work between them? Sure. It's fine. I, 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 I don't want to... Fourth yeah. Plains Castle. So all the levels except for the oh wow optional hard routes are new for the most part. All right. I did sprinkle a couple of the much easier old levels in, just to save a couple. Is Sun Pleasant an option? No. <laughs> I considered the Sacred Shell, but now I decided against it due to Wait, design philosophy. By the way, are they all the same style? No. Oh, okay. World is just my favorite, so there are a lot of those, but okay. I, I did but employ all of them. Cool. And I tried to employ every piece at least once. What game would you say has the hardest difficulties? Oh, you like mean the hardest game in general, the hardest settings? I think either way, I would say F Zero GX because even normal mode is like impossibly Kaizo speedrunner unforgiving. From what I heard, uh, Doom Eternal for casual players has just been kicking everyone's ass. I talk about him a lot, Civi Eleven. He uh, he was like, okay, I'm gonna go for ultra. And I'm gonna go for uh, ultra violence mode. I'm an, I'm an expert. And then he's like playing it. And he it was harder than he expected. Yeah. He's like, slow your roll. This is only the first level. He's like so confused. Oh. Wait. What? Oh, okay. I see now. No, nah, that's just a dick coin. I just put that there because he can't get it. <laughs> I haven't watched the video, but uh, one popped up in my recommendings of uh, how Dick Dastardly was cheated out of a legitimate victory at least once in Wacky Races. And then he never decided, he decided never to play fairly again. This is different from how it worked in uh, Super. It is, yes. I assume because they didn't want it to be uh, slow. No, that's, I, I like the change. It also does not run out, this version. Oh! Good. It is very weird to control, though, because it's not perfectly asteroid controls. No, it's, uh, it's, you, you tilt you the stick to where you want to go in it, and then you go. <laughs> I like this. This is, this is, uh, this is good. This is, this, oh, sh oh I'm tempted now. Okay, so I've been holding Y this entire time, and I can just... You get like a speed boost. Yeah. Why mode? Do you keep it? No. <laughs> so the correct answer is yes, but uh, but also no. 
So those actually can't hurt you. They can't. They just push you. They just bounce you. That's funny. Oh, damn it. Well, it's a good thing I got the checkpoint. I think pretty much everybody who made the the full eight worlds, yeah, just used one of the new one of Koopalings as a boss. Yeah. I, I tried to make the, them interesting based on their different behaviors, though. Yeah, I can see. I see that. See, this is this is interesting. My jumping accuracy really sucks. Like, it's always kind of sucked. Like, hard time telling distance. What are some other really hard games? Jack 2, I have never actually 100%ed. <gasps> oh, I thought he was gonna. I thought I could get him to land in it. Oh well, in the pit. Not because the main game is particularly difficult, but some of the side missions. Especially, there's like a skateboarding score trial thing that I've never been able to get the hang of. Uh oh. Did I just fuck myself? There's a, there's a door. I see, I thought of that. <laughs> oh, okay, I see. I see how that works. Alright, I get it now. Huh? When do I'm you guys think you're gonna do Rocket League again? I don't know. It's always an option. Yeah, so that's fun. I'm gonna be have uh, more time to stream now that it's summer. Yeah. When it comes down to whenever Jack has his days off. Which are which are on, on the weekends, but... I think we're planning next weekend. I want to do Musenet. And yeah. Maybe something else. That's not going to be a full two hours, I don't think. Yeah, and then uh, you express interest in doing AI Dungeon again and GeoGuessr again. Those are both options. What is that ninji? I guess it's just... Maybe someone's playing it right now. Ooh. Here, you know what? Look it up. <laughs> All right. What are the ninjas? Oh, here we go. This is a uh, Super Worlds. This is New Super Mario Brothers level. No, not the ninja. Don't correct me, Google. I know what I typed. Against the ninja. Oh, uh, watch ideas. Oh, uh, we need to talk about that. We have, I have some, and you have some. Oh, we have a lot. We just need to get around to yeah. one of them. And also, it comes down to if we're doing it with anyone else, people being online. Yeah. I talk I talked about I don't think we're gonna get the guys together for it. We we could do the Totally Spies movie. Yes. Instead of watching the whole series, because I don't think we need to do that. That's okay. That's fine. We don't it's I the mean, movie is the best part of it, having seen all of it. And it's not bad. It's just not worth investing all that time into. Uh, as far as live action stuff I wanna show, I wanna show everyone Miami connection. Have you heard of that? I have not. Oh man. Is it like a it's cop movie. It's a '80s uh, like action movie that was uh, released like for everybody way later. Uh, and it's it's very it's like these guy these rock musicians called Dragon Sound fighting uh, fighting a bunch of ninjas. Okay. And uh, and they, <laughs> it's great because there was like there's like one scene where. Uh, where, where they like some ninja, some ninjas were hassling him, and they're telling them like, yeah, your music sucks. And to be fair, their, their, they the song that they were introduced to was like, one's like, friends till eternity, honesty. Okay. Friends forever will be together. So it was very tacky. Yeah, and then they did a song after that, I guess declaring war on the ninjas, called Against the Ninja. I think you've mentioned this. Yes, that's that's uh, where I get it from. Oh, hey! Nice. What kind of music is it? Is it like metal? Uh, no. Hard it's, rock? It's just, <laughs> I wouldn't call it hard, but it is rock. I'm imagining, now I'm picturing Christian rock. Oh, shit. Uh, well, good thing I can just jump down. You could have also just gotten the propeller that was up there. Was there a propeller up up there? Propeller anywhere? Yes, thank you. Real men climb cliffs with no hands, wearing silly propeller hats. Jungle clock. Yeah, well, nuts to you too. Uh, according to Reddit, yeah, Sammy Zammy says that it's the number of players currently at that point in the world. Oh, cool! So they've, like, gotten to that point and saved their stock or whatever. Oh, that's cool. So it's, like... Oh, damn it. So that's the farthest those people have gotten. Hmm. Oh, I'm... I'm my time limit's running low. 
So I'm not supposed to do that? No, you're good. Okay. You just, you're just gotta scale the cliff. It's a jungle climb. Jungle climb, but with boost. Hello, Mango. Hey, Mango. Jack's playing my Super Bowl. Yes, I am. I don't know if you've seen it on any of the other streams yet. Level. What up? Phew! Made it! Thank God for that chapter feature YouTube implemented. Uh, what, what, what for? You oh, yeah. Use of that? People are using it a lot. I, 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 I like it. Maybe he means in reference to the uh, AI dungeon. Because oh, I yeah. separated the Talk to Transformer and the AI dungeon streams into the d individual stories. Cool. I I like that. I like that, that YouTube implemented that as a feature. Yeah, it's Catch and win? The fuck? Not often YouTube make, makes a good new change these days. Oh! <laughs> I like this one! This game is hard to get the hang of. I've never seen anyone get it on their first try. You could be the one, Jack. <laughs> Four fucking fork balled me. Knuckleball. Die! Ah, through fear! Right, get out of here. You fucker! Get out! <laughs> Alright. I would say that's the hardest. The matching cards is the middle one. And there's one that basically is just free lives. I, those, those I can't wait for free lives. Those are the three you can choose from. We're now gonna play a game called Free Prize. Yeah! Free fries? Free prize. Welcome the back to... The prize is rice. The price is rice. Nicole? Let me just pull something out of my pocket. Out oh. of my pocket. Pull out of my pocket. <laughs> Uh, uh, uh. This is the old, this, wait a minute. Is this? It is. Yeah, this is an old one. Yeah, this That's one. Not where that pipe usually goes. <laughs> the, the, the Vinny, the one where Vinny's like, what the fuck? That got a sequel. It's not in this Super World, but I made a Whoops too. Nice. Can't wait to play that one. No, I don't think anyone. Well, no, Sandy cleared it. I think he's the only one who has. Bob, Bop by you. Uh, that's a Mario three level. I really gotta get it. I really, I really need to get a proper job so I can get a Switch. Yeah. Play this game. I don't know though. The Switch is lifespan. I don't know where we're at at that though. I think it's, it's gonna last a while. It's wild. It's the every other Nintendo console. It's the wildly successful one. This is the Wii 2. <laughs> Not to be confused with the Wii Poo. The Wii U. The Wii U. The Wii, the Wii who? Wii U is fucking. As much as it's I like an add -on for as, the Wii, right? As much as I didn't uh, hate the Wii U, I, I I realized why it just fucking was unsuccessful. Oh yeah, this was new, right? This was added recently. Yes, this was a recent addition. And if you're holding something, you can run on the water surface with the frog suit. That's okay. That is new. Is that what the P switch is for? <laughs> this is so cool. Fucking ninja running on water. Get him. Oh, whoops. Sorry, Mario. Okay, good. <laughs> two boss seed that only lists two bosses minimum, not max. But clearly, Klaus will find bosses you don't need. Huh. So is it only a specific two bosses? Like, you can, it's not just you beat any two bosses. Alright. Oh, that's a level, though. The fish is a level? The fish is a level. The fish is a boss encounter? Swamp sashimi. <laughs> you can make uh, a variety of level icons or enemies. And they're like Hammer Bros in Mario 3. They'll start the level immediately. If you encounter them. They don't move like in Mario 3. It would be cool to have a... Uh, I don't know how they do it. A power-up toolbar like Mario 3. Yeah, that'd be cool. I, but I... There's a lot they have to consider. Ah, oh, shit in regards to potentially breaking levels. That's why I say, this uh, this one it seems to be, like, the idiot-proof version of a Mario-making level. If you want, like, actual, like, stuff that's, like, outside the box, then, you'd, then you're then you gonna have to play, uh, you're gonna have to play a ROM hack. Oh, I know. It would just be nice if they gave us the option. I know. I think if they are to do a Mario Maker 3 eventually, it probably will have more world options. Maybe. Because this was... You know, a revival for the game. This brought a lot of interest back to it. Yeah, because it's, it's like, hey, I remember. 
Because at the end of the day, Mario game mechanics are very are very solid. It's a very solid game to play. It's not like it's like it's mostly really... just a matter of adding enough stuff. And yeah. the main thing I would I would like a is more power ups. I yeah. love the turtle shell in the new in New Suit Mario Brothers DS, and that hasn't returned. Ice flower, mini mushroom, a lot of possibilities. And the one thing that would just make this game absolutely explode, like Smash Brothers huge, yeah, is if they had actually different playing controllable characters, like full NES remix. Oh yeah, they you have, have you have Link in like all sort and like all both the uh, NES, uh, like Super Mario One, Super Mario Three, uh, Super Mario World, yeah. and and they have Link in this, and they have Super Mario Brothers Two Mushroom. So those are basically fully fleshed out playstyles with very wildly different abilities. If something's popular and people want more of it, then that that should be where you should develop your sequel. Like but, a sequel, it shouldn't be just like nobody nobody wants this, or yeah, let's add a feature nobody wants. What I was saying about those two power ups is that they are limited by the fact that they are power ups. So yeah. you can't make a level that revolves around Link's mechanics. Uh oh. This, this is going to continue steadily climbing, isn't it? Yep. Alright. You can't build a level around Link's mechanics without providing a constant supply of Link power. Yeah, so having... The level. So having a... Having him be a standalone playable character that doesn't lose that by getting hit would change the levels a lot. Because you, know. you don't run the risk of dying when there's, you know, a, a two-stage power on every oh, level. Oh! This was added! Right? This was new? What was? The, the cape? Yeah. No, the cape was always here. Oh. I, I guess I was wrong. <laughs> I'm not getting rid of this fucking cape. Are you kidding me? That's actually intended for uh, if you did the ground pound after flying. That kills the flowers. Oh, I, I forgot about that. Uh, one. Oh, okay. I see. I got plenty of lives, I don't need to worry about lives, right? Oh, you say that now. Oh, is the boss gonna be really dickish? Oh, there's, there's future worlds. This is only world two, man. I know. <laughs> How many worlds uh, are in this, uh... Eight. Oh, sweet! You can do a maximum of eight worlds and 40 levels. Uh, per world? No, per this whole campaign. Oh, okay. It's 40 levels. All right. And we can always make sequels. And mine has branching paths, so, uh... Awful level. Uh, thanks. Love you, too. Like and subscribe for more. Lost a life. Oh. What does that other one say? Grandpa level? Yeah. I'm guessing because it was very simple. Granddad? Granddad? Vin Storms? I'm still proud of myself that I looked at that building and I'm like, oh, that's the fucking Flintstones theme. How many worlds are in my suit? Th this one is the full 40. Although it has branching paths, so you don't need to do all 40 levels. You can if you want to. This one's actually kind of tricky because of the fucking... I can give you a hint. Okay, what? what? You remember you can spin jump? Oh, yeah. Yeah, I, I keep forgetting because it's not a... Castlevania make would be so dope, but seeing as people love doing troll levels in this game, I can imagine it being infuriating. I could, that's something that I could see ha happening. <laughs> I did a... There's a fan-made Mega Maker, Darian, that I don't know if you knew about. Got him again. And there's also fan-made, I think multiple fan-made Zelda Makers. There's Adventure Maker and one other one. There was a there was an NES uh, Legend of Zelda maker that uh, that was like its own engine. Yeah. That uh, people use and make stuff out of some stuff that's more. Okay, good. I thought for a second like, oh, th if I touch the ground, it's gonna fucking kill me. Vin did a couple streams in the Mega Maker, and it's, it's neat. It has a lot of stuff in it. Here, when you say Mega Maker, you're not talking about 20XX, are you? No, I'm talking okay. about Mega... It's called Mega Maker. Okay. It's a Mega Man level maker from... Includes all the, all the Mega Man styles. All the NES ones. Cool. I don't think it has Super NES sprites. Hold on. Uh-oh. Hold on. Hold yeah, on. Yeah. Dude. Move it back. Appreciate it. 
<laughs> Alright, so here we are. We are in world three of eight. Oh, <laughs> hey Luigi. That's cool. Oh yeah. More of them. Can you, can you, there are a few little oh. idle dances they do. Did you see the uh, totally legit uh, world record animation of uh, Luigi's Mansion? I have not. I don't oh. watch a lot of those. You, 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 that one's pretty good because it, it, it provides an alternate. Uh... Sweet. I like this track. This is 3D world style. Yep. Hold the run button, go zoom! Move the walls closer. Dumb. I can't make this jump, it's too big! <laughs> so I posted that comment. Dumb? Or no, I posted. Ha ha! Run button, go zoom. They had to have not. No, they had to have not been holding the run button to not be able to make that basic jump. To be fair, when I was younger, I didn't know about the run button. You just, <laughs> when I was Mario, like, when I was six, Mario wanted a leisurely pace. Can you beat this level without hitting the run button once? Oh shit! Oh well. So your levels are starting to get slightly harder, or I'm just terrible at this game. Either one could work. Doom 2016 had the mode called Snap Map, which was essentially Doom Maker. Oh yeah, no, I heard about that. That was a popular mode. It, and uh, aside, uh, the only thing that was like wrong from the otherwise really good uh, Twitch, or not Twitch, uh, Switch port of uh, Doom 2016 was uh, that... Snap map wasn't on there. Not enough games have uh, level editors anymore. Level editors are fun. Like I, that was so cool about Tony Hawk. Level editing and modability. Oh, so I uh, so I acquired Slay the Spire recently, and there's a Dio is a is a is a character you can add to it with Dio cards. With like a like someone modded him in or something. Yeah, as like a character, Dio. Because each. Roller. So. Oh, okay. So he has a, a card called Aura, and if you and if you use it, you put a, you get another Aura from the discard pile and add it to your hand up to a certain point. Is an O R A. Oh yeah. Also, Zawalo uh, is a card. But shouldn't his be Muda? Or no, it is Muda. Sorry. Aura is uh, the, the 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 Jonathan Joestar boss, which is, was added in with that mod. Oh shit. Ha! Ah! Oh. Darn. So what's the gimmick for this level? Is it just like a level? Just the cat, basically. Ah. That, that was too risky. Like, I should've just did the long jump for that one. Oh, Alright, that's fine. I'm cool, I'm cool with uh, how that ended up. Ho ho! Jack, why aren't you liking my levels? I'm offended. Oh, uh, I'd be liking... You can't give likes to your own levels. That's the joke. <laughs> so somebody got here and then quit. Apparently. Which I wonder if they means they that means they started this level, or if they cleared this level, and this was the last one they cleared. Dead tunnel. <laughs> That's not good. Back to Super Mario World. Ah. I've been watching. Uh, bones. I've been watching some old uh, Joel streams. Yeah. And apparently, uh, Kaze Manuar, the guy who makes all the Mario 64 one hacks. Yeah. Literally, every one ever made, it's all him. Uh, there was a Super Mario 64 maker. Super Mario 64. Wait, it, pl it plays like a debug mode, where you can just like move pieces and resize them around and make make a. A okay. rudimentary Mario 64 level in game. Huh. I don't know how replayable it is, but it was a neat proof of concept. I like I like when people are just like, oh, you, you think this engine is inflexible? Well, look what I can do with it. I play Mario Odyssey when you can play Super Mario 64 Odyssey. Somebody made a Turing compatible uh, uh, computer in your fortress. How much do you know about Door Fortress? Not much. Uh, I know it's coming out on Steam. It's like randomly generated. It's like super detailed because the guy puts everything in his life into it. Yeah. <laughs> and it's like like rudimentary Atari graphics, right? Uh, Kinda, ASCII art, yeah. not Atari graphics. 
That it, it, it's better than Atari graphics, but it's still Asgard. Except if you say so. Except uh, for the Steam version, he's doing an actual uh, de fully detailed title set. Interesting. So I'm looking forward to that. Door Fortress is a good time if you know how to play it. <laughs> and even if you don't, just the stories that come out of Door Fortress are entertaining. When are, when are we getting Door Fortress? Oh, God. Ganon visits the door fortress. He sees a bunch of barely functioning alcoholic dwarves, and he's like, What the fuck? What do you believe will be the arms fighter for Smash on Monday? Honestly, oh, I is have there, no is, idea. Is there an arms fighter in coming to. Of course, it is. Yeah, the next. They announced that the first new DLC in Pack 2 will be from arms. And that's all they've said about it. Okay. And uh, everyone's been waiting for when the actual reveal will be. It's gonna be the woman, isn't it? They finally scheduled it on uh, the twenty second, so this it, coming it's, Monday. It's gonna be it's gonna be the the woman. Which, which one? Ribbon Girl. Yeah, her. Twin Tail is extremely popular, and uh, Min Min is another popular choice. God damn! Why can't I avoid that fucking boat? There are a lot of characters it could be. People are people are doubting. Springman because he's already an assist trophy. Yeah, that, that's probably it. If <laughs> they have him as that and be an assist trophy. Which, if it is Springman, then that disproves... That's the first time that an assist trophy has been promoted within the same game. And if it's not Springman, it's the first time that a first entry in a franchise has not been the face of the franchise. So either way, it'll break new ground. Unless... It's like a series of alts. And it's just all of them. It's just like four characters. Oh, like uh, like Dragon, like the hero yeah. from Dragon Quest. Because a lot of them have similar body types. Just you know, the skinny one, Spring Man, Ribbon Girl, One Man. So how? So I wonder what the, how the fighter is going to be then. If they're just going to be like a oh, rocket punch. I if it plays anything like Arms, which I did a brief stream of because they had a, a free to play period. Yeah, it was okay. I didn't. I wasn't crazy about it. I bet you weren't. It's but, a. But the thing about it is that uh, whenever someone's attacking, if you hit their fists, you can knock them away. So ah. I'm ex I'm anticipating Smash will be like that. Hmm. Is that you'll be able to knock their long range attacks away? <laughs> I couldn't slow down in time. What the fuck? Well, I'm having a lot of trouble with this section. Distracted by a big, strong arms. Big, strong guns. Aren't they? It's gotta... You have a type? Muscles! It's gotta be muscles! Big, strong muscles! Don't have one. You didn't see that picture? Oh, uh, no. I said somebody, like, telling them, uh, telling this, uh, this cartoon dude, like, Hey, what, what's your type? And then it's just a thought bubble of uh, just quickly, like, just a bunch of, fit, like, really muscular girls. And then the bottom is just him saying, don't have one. Uh, I ain't got no type. Bad, bad bitches are the only kind I like. But that's a type, bro. Hmm. Oh. Do you want to ride the bone roller coaster? Oh, I... I don't. Mr. Bones Wild Ride. The ride never ends. I bet Mario Maker 3 is going to have a Mario 64 Maker. Now, that it's such a different thing, it would have to be its own game. A 3D Mario Maker. Which I don't think they'll do. This is probably going to be uh, the previous one. I want to see which one it is. If they were to do... Uh, I think I've mentioned this before. Oh, this one! If, it, if they were to do a 3D game maker, I think the best candidate would probably probably be Crash because of how linear the levels are. That would be good. Spyro. <laughs> Spyro would be... Wait, Wait is this is this one I've done before? I think so. I don't, I don't, I don't, sure. I don't really remember it all that well. Anything that's like free-roaming open world is a little bit trickier. Yeah. But Crash... It's already kind of tile-based if you in incorporate the crates. Huh. I just wait for him to explode, right? No? He's not mad. He's not gonna explode. We have uh, great new party members in the new Paper Mario. Like, a ba bomb Oh, there are party members in the new one? Just, you know, nondescript ba bomb, just black. 
Regular face, nothing oh. unique. <laughs> I bet you wanted. I thought you. I thought you guys wanted. <laughs> okay, I can't leave. Because I died. <laughs> you yeah, can't no. save your life like that. Yeah. Oh, I, I, I would think a crash creator would be cool if executed right, and uh, Sonic Maker would have a lot of fun possibilities. A 2D one. Oh, you gotta fight the mushroom. Cordyceps Cliffs. <laughs> nice! The... They get inside you, Luigi. And they start growing. It ain't pretty. That's what Terminal 7 actually is. It's not brain cancer. It's a... It's a... Only in the overworld at night do the are the power-ups allowed to exert their free will to run away from you. I wear my sunglasses at night. Oop. Oh, yeah. Oh, no! Oh, jeez. It just made, like, an enemy kill noise when you got that with inborn frames. Thank God. Come back here! Uh, no! There we go. <laughs> you bastard! <laughs> that was... Oh well, this is this is simple enough. It's a little harder if you don't kill the Hammer Brothers. Good to kill the Hammer Brothers before you go down there. Oh, damn it! Oh, he's a spawner. Oh no no! Please no! No, I don't okay. want to eat my mushrooms. That was. I had a much uh, less difficulty with this with this level than I did with the fucking dead cliff sea. Fuck. Alright. I'm gonna laugh, laugh if Sakurai subverts everyone's expectations and one of the new fighter pass characters is from a show. I know. Which show? Which show? We're <laughs> gonna get Raymond Reddington as a. If they did that, it would almost certainly be Goku, but I don't want that to happen. Pop and win. Smash. It's everyone's favorite kind of Mario Party mini. So is this the free? Is this free prize? It's, yeah, basically free five lives. Three lives. All right, it's time for the for a game called Free Prize. Nicole. This one is Krusty Cave Castle. All right. I don't know if there's a fan Metroid maker or not. Um, Metroid and Kirby seems like they could be things that could exist if people wanted to make them. Oh, do I? Do I have to? No, I don't. I knew. Welcome to boot level featuring boot. Come on. You can't actually spawn boots without Goombas in them. Oh no. Oh, I, I, I was trying to be fancy. Oh well. It's on another uh, old Joel stream. Of uh, Famicom fighters, Famicom fighters. Of uh, it's a it's a Mugen game. Oh yeah. And it's all uh, original NES characters with NES sprites and everything. It's really well made. Oh, that's cool. Like uh, Super Mario Brothers One has like fully fluid animations and everything. It, lo it looks good. Hmm. Yeah, that's not gonna work. What the fuck? Do I have to jump on the fucking fireball? You can, in fact, jump on the fireballs. Okay. Because <laughs> I'm like, oh, okay, that's that's too, way too complicated. They're not expecting me to. Uh oh. <laughs> 
<laughs> Damn it. Oh. Your levels are getting steadily tougher. There is a difficulty curve. If they put Goku in, they'd have to downplay his abilities a lot. Oh, for sure. That's why I don't want him in. He'd be so watered down, it wouldn't be Goku anymore. Unless, unless Mario's actually stronger than we think. No. Mario, even Saiyan Saga. Like Nappa's flicking a finger and blowing up an entire city. How do you work with that? <laughs> they have Saiyan. They have Saiyan class in Slave Spire. Fuck. As a mod. Yeah. Um. It's a weird combo system going on, but yeah, it's not as broken as a fucking Toho character, so take that for what you will. Let, let me get this straight. You, you're part Soul Reaper. You've got some Quincy in you. You're, you're born human. The bloody hell is a Saiyan. What the fuck is this? What did you just say? Oh man, just take a, just take a bunch of clean uh, Frieza, like. Uh, like audio, and then just just reenact the fucking Navy Seals copy pasta. Okay. What the fuck was, did you just say about me, you bitch? It's supposed to be Kuratsuchi, but sure. Yeah. Oh, did I did I fuck myself? Yeah, I fucked myself. That's what the doors are for. I'll always include fuck yourself doors. <laughs> I caught it once. What's wrong with me? I could see a. There we go. I could conceivably see a Toho character or a me costume. It would have to be just like oh, a storm of teeny tiny, barely damaging hits. And I don't know how fun that would be. It'd be funny. It'd be funny. Just welcome to Bullet. Oh, Dark Horse candidate. Oh, this one. Uh, what was I gonna say? Dark Horse candidate. Hotline Miami character. Yeah. Probably yeah, not. The but... Devolver's making a name for themselves. They're De not repped yet. They're not repped yet? Or... They, uh, they're running out of Japanese companies to add. Yeah. Pretty much the only major one left is the Blast Blue guys. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. There's no fucking checkpoints. <laughs> I guess there is only one checkpoint on this level. I didn't use two of them. Oh, Ruby. Get, get something from, like, the Ruby series. Eh. R. W. B. Y. If they're gonna rep an anime, I'd rather rep a, re a real anime. <laughs> don't, don't gatekeep anime! It's funny because, like, Goku's had more video games than a lot of people in the Smash roster by now. Yeah. He, well, I guess licensed video games do count. He's, like, a real... He can be in Video Land. Captain N would recognize him as a fellow, uh... Captain N for Smash. Captain N, the Game Master. That'd be, a, that'd be an obscure fucking, uh, character to add... Rayman is someone that people... He was on the top ten in Europe popularity poll. You know... You know how Rayman's anatomy is weird? Yeah. Then I remember the mad, the Madness Combat universe and how they're in, they're, they've got the same kind of hands. Yeah. God. I, I, he's still cranking out Madness Combat stuff. It's just taking him a while since he was, like, making a game. I liked Rayman 1, but I haven't really kept up with any part of the series after that. There so. was Rayman the Great Escape. Yeah, we did We did play that briefly. Then there was the uh, other Rayman, like, side-scrolling plot. Then there was Raving Rabbids! I know it's supposedly good again with Origins. I, di I just don't know anything about how that plays or if it goes back to Rayman 1 gameplay at all. Hey, I did it! Like, if they were to add Rayman, I don't think it would be anything I recognize at this point. Same for Paper Mario. I don't want them to add Paper Mario anymore, because they, they fuck him up. I just know it. What the fuck? Am I, am I missing something? Try a running start. Okay. Oh, okay, I get it. There we go. Mm. What? The 
there was a checkpoint. It was optional. You didn't find it. <laughs> Great. Thanks. Thanks, buddy. Oh, wrong button. Oh, no. It, it, spin jumps don't exist in this version. Nope. <laughs> haven't been invented yet. So you mentioned uh, Skate as uh, being... Um, oh, yeah, they're made. making a... Well, they're making a new Skate. We don't know if it's a Skate 4 or if it's a remake. But it's EA, so I don't... Uh, I don't trust it, no. I'm like... And, uh, and even then, I liked Tony Hawk better than Skate. Yeah. And that's why I said Skate's fine. Skate was only really interesting to me because of how, like, glitchy and buggy it looked. And it's a very... It's not something you can replicate easily intentionally. No. Even if they chose to, which I doubt they will. Probably fix it, and make it boring. That was Vinny's complaint with uh, some of the bridge builder games. They fixed it and it was like, yeah, oh. it was it was less glitchy for a time. Then they made it more glitchy. I guess. I think he just stopped playing them until a uh, bridge constructor portal. Oh, shit. Oh, this level's hard. This boss is uh, challenging. I gave him mushroom. Speaking of EA, yeah, uh, I guess they just announced. Oh, I beat them. A bunch of games, like seven games, coming to the Switch. Oh, which ones? I, I don't know all of them. One of them is Burnout Paradise, releasing for the umpteenth time. Maybe this will be the better one. I mean, well, unlike the Steam version, maybe it'll actually run. <laughs> like, so it's EA, and it won't. You know it. But even then, I have mixed feelings. I don't, I don't know that I want to give them my money. And also, a big part of the reason I enjoyed it so much on the PS3 was the custom soundtrack feature, which isn't isn't on the Switch, obviously. Yeah. Just driving around Paradise City, and there's a chance that you skip track, and then Yon Cat comes on or some World shit. World 4 is the, the lethal lava? Wait. Well, everyone does. <laughs> okay, Every, good. Everyone does a World 8 lava. No, I'm gonna do... So, oh, I, this I'm makes gonna secure expectations. Mr. Bunny Mild Die! <laughs> oh, man. You like auto-scrollers? This is the first auto-scroller you've done. You've really held yourself oh, back. Wait to the last world. Are they all auto scrollers? <laughs> no. Yeah. Oh shit. There are a disproportionate number towards the end. Is that just? He's like, hey, you know, be cool auto scrollers. No, it just happened that way. Well, because the second to last world has two uh, airships, so there's a section where you're like catching up with the airship. Ah. Uh, oh no. Okay. Good. <laughs> Uh, very fortunate for Luigi that he is immune to toxic fumes. It's not lava, it's just really hot blood. Oh. It's a. Uh, it's... Oh no, I have to swim in this big patch of ragu! I'm a hot blooded. Check it and see. Gather fever of 103. Come on, the Oh, that's cool. Princess. Princess. They had to make. Uh, oh, never mind. I'm, I'm not gonna say anything because uh, potential Odyssey spoilers. Yeah, we'll, we'll, we're gonna get to that soon. That's the plan tomorrow. Tomorrow, I love you. Tomorrow. Oh! <laughs> I didn't see that coming. I literally didn't. Firefish. Country 2's Last World, where every, every level has an area that you can't go back from. I guess that was kind of the case. Mango has been uh, playing a ton of the Donkey Kong 1 and 2 randomizers since discovering them. They're fun. It looks fun. I gotta, I gotta do one of my own. Uh-oh. Uh okay, good. Oh, good, a checkpoint. Okay, all right. Oh, no. You better go faster, Jack. <laughs> Fire. 
Spider Luigi just looks sickly. He looks like he looks like he's a radiation worker. Yeah. What? What? Oh, okay, I get it now. That's why you had the death. Uh oh. Uh. 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 Okay, good. <laughs> for you. If you know the words, you can join in too! Banjo Kong. Banjo Kong. They made DK64 before either of the Banjo games, right? Uh... No, after. Oh. After both of them? After... I, I believe so. Oh, so that, that's how the progression <laughs> happened. Because they're like, hey, you know what's popular? Collecting things. We need lots of things you to You know collect. what? Kirby, uh, Kirby figure, figured it out when, they, when it went to the 64. Because they were basically just like, we can't do this game 3D. You know what we're going to do? Let's just let's just have it be 2D, but with the 3D background. They invented 2.5D. Yeah. Oh. I mean, it existed before. Uh-oh. Uh, but... uh, help! I think you're too close. No! To the, I think you were too close to the pipe for another one to spawn. I can do it. <laughs> Air walking. After this, if there is time, since we're here and we're not really going to be doing anything else, I'd like to on stream show you some of the games I've I've uh, found. It's going to get and be dinner time by the time we're done. I think. Oh, well. oh, oh, three lives. Shit. All right, I'm gonna I'm gonna be more, I'm gonna be calmer about this. Well, there goes my chance at an extra life. Let us up now. I'm not gonna risk it. I risk I say as I risk it. Super Mario what? Come on! Are you serious? There's a problem with the Yeah. Maybe it doesn't uh spawn a new one until the old one's off screen is how it works. I'm locked in. I was nowhere near that hitbox. Are you serious? Oh, <sighs> tentacles, man. <sighs> Cthulhu eats 1d4 investigators per round. Alright, let's try that again. From the top. Mild tide. There's there's nothing mild about that fucking tide. Well, the tide's not moving fast. We're sailing in the open blood sea. I'm sailing away. This is the lake of fire that uh, that fucking uh, people in uh, in uh, the that one James Cameron book series talk about. Was it left behind? Kirk Cameron? Yeah. Sorry, did I say James Cameron? I meant Kirk. You know that James Cameron is raising the bar. Yeah. Kirk Cameron is uh, is religious. You know Kirk Cameron had a had a movie where he was about Christmas called Kirk Cameron Saving Christmas. Yeah. You've heard of it. Uh, you might have mentioned it before. Yeah, I figured I did. No. That one uh, involved uh, involved just a guy telling three stories about about how Christmas is more than just about presents and stuff, which is the heart was in the right place, but it also involved a dude who happened to be the Saint Nicholas character, just yeah. uh, just beating the shit out of somebody for not believing in Christmas hard enough, Aww. and then smiling, He's like yeah, let's go meet the children afterwards, and the guy is uh, take away from this like Santa's badass. Was this Felis? Uh, no, it was somebody else. But yeah, yeah Felix is watching the Totally Spies movie soon. Oh, uh, cool. Was this better or worse than uh, Miss Miss Whatsama College Christmas Extravaganza? Oh, mi oh, uh, Miss Velma. 
No, it was better. It had it had a budget, and it wasn't filmed by as if it was like from a fucking cult. You got greedy. It's fine. Uh, it's a net positive. I'm gonna do that again. Oh, I got a fire flower. I didn't use it a whole lot, actually. What about the Star Wars Christmas special? That's quality stuff. Star Wars. <laughs> the omen left them for life day before you know it. Julie. <laughs> <laughs> And in the movie, uh, The Force Awakens, it was just, like, there was just the uh, characters who had nothing to do with, with the original trilogy, just like, we gotta take a shit, we'll take this one in. Oh, but that one looks like it's a piece of shit, and it's the Millennium Falcon. Yeah. And they use it to get out, and then some other group, like, boards them, and they don't know who it is, and it turns out it's fucking Han Solo and Chewie, and he's like, Chewie, we're home. That was another disc-shaped ship, wasn't it? The Fal Millennium Falcon. Yeah, yeah, it, it, it yeah, it was mostly disc-shaped. You were talking about bang, it, and you're like, bang, 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 and and your reason, and you're like asking me like, what what reason does this is the Enterprise designed the way it is? Because Star Trek is a long storied series franchise with a lot of a lot of things that they do bother to explain. I was yeah. curious if the ship shape whatever came into. So, the closest I can I can come is uh, somebody saying, "Well, originally it was supposed to be hard sci-fi." Um, so no, it was never. Really it was up. like it was. It's not explained why. Never said, "Oh, it's aerodynamic," or "Oh, it needs to." You be don't need way. to be aerodynamic in space. No, There's no true. air friction. I mean, this is how the gravity system works. Although, or something. although I think originally it was it was designed as like, oh, we don't want to do transporters. We'll just have the ship land everywhere, which is why maybe that's why it was designed that way because it was like, oh, it'll be aerodynamic for when we go into the atmosphere. And then they're like, no, we don't want to have we don't have enough budget to animate ships landing on 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 the planet. Let's just have a fucking transporter. Yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. So this is a shortcut, right? Yes. Let's see what it is. Which level is this? Hey, Sandy, have you tried scratching the bullet? <laughs> this one. All right. This is the one I remember. Yeah. I love how Ray managed to fix the Millennium Falcon instantly when Han Solo's been flying it his whole life and couldn't fix it. Yeah. Sandy with the shot up. Construction zone. That's, Shut that's, up. that's our favorite new Yu-Gi-Oh character. Shut up! Just the, the His name is Shut Up, and every time Kaiba says it, he sounds angry, like he's telling someone to shut up. Yeah. It's weird because... Because, uh... Oh, you can't actually use those to... What? Hold what on. are you trying to do? Like, hide in one like Snake? No, I was... Let's try to throw it. It's hard to find a use for this. What is... Wait, what is this power-up? You're, you're, you're in stealth mode now. Oh, can I just, uh... Well, they'll still hurt you on contact, but... Uh, Sneaking fish, but they won't actively... They won't aggro. Oh, fucking shit! <laughs> You've been found! I, okay, this level, this level seems interesting. So it's just stealth mission. The last update added, uh, like, five new wearable power-ups to 3D World. Which are neat, but I don't like 3D World enough to make a level for each of them. So I kind of I put a bunch of the other ones together in, like, in a later level. I like this, actually. Stealth mode. Wait, hold on. Um, hmm. Oh, I can still wall jump. Wait. Am I missing something? You are missing something. What am I missing? Do I... Oh, no. Don't tell me. Do I need to bring a box? No. Okay. 
I don't think you can carry things as a Goomba. What? Look at those boxes there. I don't know, just decoration. Like you're finding the secret Goomba costume in a bunch of crates lying around. Uh, okay, I see how it is. I get it now. Do I want it? No, I'm not, I'm not gonna risk it. Don't want to potentially offend that passive hammer brother. Hey, buddy! Hey, this is my lunchroom, you get out of here!
So, I, I, I want to say that one of my favorite uh, Djibouti dub ones is when they did a telenovela uh, dub. Yeah. You see that one? I have not. No! My perfect son is kissing a puta! A puta? A puta. There you go. Is that a Mexican insult? Yeah. I think it's like poor. She's like... And it's just this girl in a wheelchair. And she's like confused as to why her mom... Uh, alright. Well, I guess I'm going back. You keep getting the hammer when you don't need it. Well, I'm trolling up, and sometimes it just doesn't register for me. No, I mean this one right here. Oh, yeah. What? Oh! <laughs> Only so many out at once. I don't know. I can't trust. It's a good thing my timer reset. God damn it. Uh, oh, something I noticed Joel did recently is he started doing, uh, uh, he at some point started, uh, Morrowind. Oh, yeah? Yeah, that game, that game is fucking great, great. I, uh, I owned it when I was on Xbox, and I'm like, oh, hey, uh, RPG, open world? Sure, I'm down with that, and I was playing it, and I'm like, this is actually pretty fun. Just exploring, like, an alien ultra-detailed world. That's probably gonna dis disappear. One, some of these are gonna disappear. Yeah. When you summon a new one. Oh. Mother f <laughs> So close. <laughs> this is where you get off. Oh. Yeah, in Morrowind, uh... Alchemy is, uh, it, it spellcast is incredibly broken. You can make some really crazy combinations. I thought you were gonna say it was like a, like a sim, like it was Ishval. No, it's not a sim, it's an RPG. It's a sim. Oh. Like Full Metal Alchemist? Oh. <laughs> no, uh, in Full Metal Alchemist, alchemy can't be used to bring the dead back the dead, but in this and more when alchemy can be used to make you immortal. You make a potion that, like, heals you for, like, in-game hours for, like, 100 seconds at a time. I don't know if that was a wise move. Ah! This is so difficult! I... Why did you have to make the mountain? I wanted to use the boxes. I wanted to make sure you had to use the boxes. Yeah, well, I'm using them and it's still not working. They're just not being patient enough. <laughs> they, don't... Well, they can't both disappear. <laughs> uh, all right, you know what? Don't don't hit start over. It'll reset the level. If you, if you die, you'll go back to the checkpoint. That's a, that's a shortcoming some people aren't happy about. Well, yeah, that's, that's fine. You can just kill yourself. Yeah, that'll be enough. Hey, Izuku! You're having trouble with the level? How about you just kill yourself? And then in your next life, you can beat it. Bakugo's a jerk. He's a fucking ass. I'm told he gets better, but not by that much. You know what? I, 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 people, people say Sasuke's bad. Sasuke didn't tell Naruto to kill himself. I mean, they weren't friends, but no, they, were they weren't like they were the best of friends. You just don't see that on camera. They were overly antagonistic to each other, though. Yeah. And you know, Naruto cared enough about Sasuke to want to like, to, like bring him back, as opposed to just. Leaving him to die. You know, everyone is the best of friends, and everyone is reformable in Naruto world. <laughs> it's great. <laughs> I mean, you think Orochimaru and uh, Kurosuchi would talk? Probably. They just like. I don't get that till you need it. Yeah. I've learned my lesson. Oh, wow. 
Make it, yeah, I can. Safety box. Don't fucking time. They're in with the 3D Squidward emotes. Oh, hey, cool. Why didn't you put that beforehand? Well, because then you wouldn't have had to. You could have just run across the spikes and not had to use the boxes. Fair enough. Oh, God, they're going uphill. <laughs> you brilliant son of obstruction technology. Uh-oh. Better go back. Better start climbing. Yeah, that's right, they can go uphill. Can you make the blood run up the walls? I don't see why not. There we go. Hey! hey. You want to use boxes to get up? Okay. Oh, I th here, here's a move that's not super well known. If you hold the sh hold the shoulder button and press up to start spinning and then jump, you can do a high jump while you're spinning. Oh, okay. There's also a backflip high jump. Three year world has a lot of weird, not explained movement options. Challenging level. There was a Meat Canyon skit where Sasuke was like, out of all the experiences we've had, out of all the countless hours of me glaring at you and you not saying a word, how did that translate to, oh, this guy's my best friend? <laughs> Maybe... I may never to make considered him as like a that's, friend. That's bullet scratch. Oh yeah, you're right. Ghost house. I haven't done one of these yet. House of the doll maker. Multiplayer versus level. Which really just means it, it won't break if you play the multiplayer. I like how you have the opportunity. Did you use do this level because you could have the awesome NES Ghost House theme? Uh, no. Oh, hello. This is just the this is the Magic Koopa level. Oh yeah, that's right. I can't. Uh... There are new. Oh, the Magic Koopas were part of this latest. Mecha Koopas. Mecha Koopas. Magic yeah. Koopas are the spellcaster oh. dudes. Which this had to be a translation thing. Is that these things being called. What the f? Red. I don't want to know what those do. Oh! Hello! I missed you! Oh, sh! <laughs> I'm like, oh, I know what that means! It had to be a translation issue, them being called Mecha Koopas, because they don't look like Koopas, they look like Bowser. They're Mecha Bowsers. Yeah, well, Bowser is called King Koopa in Japan. Right. How did I miss that? Missed what? How did I miss that the first time? I didn't pick it up. Oh, uh, you were small, so you got a normal mushroom. Oh, yeah. Why was I small? Did I miss a... Must have gotten hit. Do I have to hold... Oh, I have to hold it. Okay. So either they didn't realize that they were supposed to be little mechanical Bowsers, or else they just didn't like the sound of Mecha Bowser. Oh, we can always get another one. Yeah, yeah, they fire something. I don't know what they fire, but... These red rockets. Oh, really? Oh, <laughs> shit! So, Mario <laughs> 2 Mushroom's cool, but it can kind of not be as good for platforming in some cases. Oh, whoops. I accidentally hung up on my mom. You need to like, go out and talk to her. Give me a sec. I'm gonna see what they... <laughs> 
Could you be quiet? Por favor. Gon and Kalula are such a better version of what Naruto and Sasuke should have been. <laughs> it wasn't my mom. <laughs> she was in the other room. It's like, wait, I didn't call you. Like, yeah, you did. So you Some up. other person. <laughs> <laughs> it's probably my. She's like, it's probably your dad using your phone. Yeah, he's hooked up to the car. Maybe, like, you? Maybe. Here, I'll put him on speaker. Okay, should we? Uh, not a good idea. <laughs> you want to mute the microphone? or I, I'm good. We don't have a command for that. No. Unfortunately. I'm going to grab another drink while you're doing go this. Go for it. One more moment, please. One moment. This is going to be a longer stream than normal, obviously, because this is a special occasion. Hello? No, that false alarm. Hello? Did you call me? Well, mom didn't call me and she, and it was her phone. Well, no, because I went out and talked to her and she said she didn't call me and that it must have been you. But mom, but mom said it wasn't her, and she thought it was you. I, I don't know. I'm trying to figure this out. So neither you or mom called me, despite. What? I did. He did. He said he didn't call me, though. Do, 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 no, I called... But he, he just said he didn't call me. <laughs> I... Uh, alright, alright. I'll... Love you too. Bye. It's my dad playing a prank. Oh, <laughs> damn you, Mr. Friction. There's some levels I do later where the that's designed for Mario 2. This one's more just a power up. Which even then, as you saw, isn't always helpful. Yeah. Actually, he can't I... even kick stuff, can he? No, he just kinda. No, you. It's an interesting, uh... Oh, they use the, the heart get sound. Come on. Let's go! Oh, well... <laughs> something where it's absolutely necessary. Let's try that again. Let's try that again. For real this time. You could, like, jump on them in sequence, not straight to the last one. No. It's not hard enough. <laughs> not hardcore. I have to go on a pot of core. It's like playing Super Meat Boy. New Super Meat Boy coming. Oh, Super Meat Boy Forever? Yeah. Super Meat Boy Universe. Like Meat Boy and Spelunky. No, still no, still no date for Spelunky. Uh oh. Good. Good, good, good. Nope. Fuck that. Okay. I forgot. No, uh. Screw it! <laughs> Bye! Good enough. Alright, let's see what this 
this, uh, this another free prize? Nope. Maybe I take it back. I think this one's the hardest. Like, you can at least get good at the baseball one. This is just slots. They're pro There must be people who can do that consistently every time. Speedrunners. I'm definitely not one of them. It's always... The answer is always speedrunners. Frame perfect. Tufa friendship. It was the brothership, but then they retconned that. They're just friend. It is a it was a retcon, wasn't it? Hey, it's a nice day in Lava Land. Look at that blue sky. Oh sh shit! <laughs> I made the mistake. Is this not a, is this a previous level? No. Okay. But seriously, you should have uh, fixed up Sun Pleasant and like added it. Nice ten second level. Take a lot of fixing up. Mm -hmm. That's totally a fixer up for. Uh oh. That's not good. I have a, I had a little girl on my bus just before the end of the school year who, who didn't call the movie Frozen 2. It was Anna Elsa 2. What's your favorite movie of the year? Anna Elsa 2! Ah, I'm surprised I got that. I'm surprised. He's able to fit in that door easily. He just turns sideways. It's like Paper Mario. Oh. Oh, man. You leave. There he goes. Chain Chomp for Smash Brothers. Give him a tennis racket. I was like, like thinking, don't we already have? And I'm like, oh no, that's just piranha plant. Let's, uh. Let's well, not. Oh, it's both of them! No, they're just friends. Tag team! We tag team. They're basically just the two most basic vanilla Koopalings. It seemed like a waste to just have them as regular fights. Because they don't do anything fun or unique. I'm just gonna avoid, avoid it now, because I'm just gonna fucking fight him. This is kind of the point where the power-ups become, like, liabilities in the boss fights. Yeah. You, you did you did a good job, and, uh... Oh! But, which one's the correct op- Wait. One of them will lead to a quick route, but only three of you can go. The other one leads to a long and arduous route. <laughs> I know that's from Hunter x Hunter, but I've been I've been watching a lot of I've been watching Let's Plays of the Zero Escape game series, and that reminds me of that Zero Escape. It's like it is. You know how uh, Flash games had escape rooms? Yeah. Well, that one is just like a series of visual novels slash escape room games, and uh, they're immensely popular. Also, featuring a plot that's kind of insane, yeah. involving like uh, like mental dimension like alternate universe travel oh. and uh and like a dude who's like a really classy yes shifting sand land hey, it's a slightly less hot here the pyramids curse oh no you s okay this this isn't inside the level is it Good. No, I, I know to avoid the just plain old shitty condition types. No one likes desert wind. So that I Oh shit! I figured you were gonna make use of this. This was a good. Uh... Well, illusion ruined. It's fine. We we'll keep going. Speed! This, this level might actually get me to game over. Maybe. Oh, you think so? I think I, this level seems pretty tricky at that second part. 
That's why the key's glowing. I'm like, why is that fucking key glowing? And then that mask was coming. I'm like, oh, that's why. This has been one of the more popular ones. People seem to like this level online. That was embarrassing. <sighs> I just gotta hold. I just gotta hold right. Cause then I'll I'll slide peacefully in. Slide it in. Slide it in. Hey, hey Mario, I've been listening to White Snake. Luigi, <laughs> that music rot rots your brain. Sorry, gonna listen to some nice electro swing. <laughs> I I don't know, Mario. Don't you think you're trying a little too hard to reach the kids these days? Think about it. Trying to reach the. Okay, I see. I see how it is now. It's crisscross. What the? Who texting me? Uh, Dad wants a cookie. Are you gonna allow it? Uh, sure. Here, I'll, I'll go out. All right. Give me one while you're at it. <laughs> I like it. Oh, blueberries. Pause? Mm hmm I figured you'd keep going. That's yeah, fine. Oh, thank you. Got some, mm. uh, Tinder. Cookies on sale at Albertsons. Oh, man. It's one of them, their, uh, Northwest locations. Up there with that, their, uh, Safeway. <laughs> Thread the needle. Our Safeway mentioned like a parody song at one point. Mm -hmm. and it kind of caught me off guard because it's a, it's not a nationwide chain. No. It's like Sonic. Sonic's not nationwide. There's no Sonics in the Pacific Northwest. All right. Where's the nearest one? Probably like uh, Portland. I can double check. Yeah, Portland. That's I mean, that's right. you're closer to it than, than I am. I know that uh, Sonic's uh, like marketing strategies to just do advertisements, or at least they did. They just had market. They just had advertisements uh, in places they don't have Sonic. So then you see a Sonic, you're like, oh, I can be getting advertisements from there. What the hell? Yeah, they're all the, they're all over I five. Are they? Uh oh. <laughs> Here. Assumptions. Oh, it's by SeaTac. And, and there's one up in Marysville. Is there one in Tacoma? Uh, yeah. Oh, I should I should tell my brother. Hey, hey, bro. There's a Kaiser. There's a there's a fucking Sonic's near where you are. Hello, Trog. Hey, Trog. And the gang's all here. My chat dropped, I don't know how long ago we posted that. This guy is way nicer than he would be in Mario 2. Oh yeah. He's speedy in Mario 2. Yeah. Whoa! I forgot about that. I generally only use sound effects when they're, like, helpful to the level. You're a good level designer. I'm, uh... It'll be, it's a shame that you don't, uh, that you don't get into it, but, you know, you 
you, what makes you happy, and what you feel like you can... I have a lot of interests, it's just, again, how much time I have to expend on them. Damn it. Alright. Short hop. <laughs> Too short to hop! I already had a lot of time was, uh, being taken up by Bleacher Bridge. Yeah. Last two summers I was doing audiobooks, and the one I made last summer is still not out of the review process yet. Is it not? No. Why not? Well, well it went in, and in uh, January I finished it, because the editing took a very long time, and I just didn't hear from them for months. Yeah. So you asked about it? I, con I finally contacted them about it in, like, March or something. It's supposed to be like a maximum of 30 days process or something. Yeah. And uh, they didn't really give an explanation as to why it had taken so long. They just finally did it. And they said, oh, well, there's this problem with it. So I fixed the problem like the next day. Sent it back in. I haven't heard anything. You think, it, you think it's due to COVID? I'm sure that's part of it because they're like less staffed than they would otherwise be. But You throw a skeleton at another skeleton, it kills them both. Yeah. Shit! Alright. There we go. Got it right this time. That's also kind of a pain, though, because Audible has a, has a deal right now where you make extra money on it. Oh! To help artists during COVID. You think, you think... And I'm not getting anything from the book because they're dragging their heels putting it through. Is that why they don't want it, they don't want you to make extra money? I don't know. I mean, that would be, that would suck if that was the case. They want all the goodwill without any of the actual payout. Not Audible themselves, maybe, oh, I don't want to, I don't want to I mean, speculate. I, oh, shit. I have no idea. It's just, it's just frustrating. Not my, yeah, I agree. Got a checkpoint. Oh, that's good. This year I'm not doing an audiobook. I need to, uh, I want to try to buckle down on more, uh, freelance voice stuff. I need to make a demo reel. Yeah. This year, in the summer, I'm trying to, uh, get trained for, uh, HVAC, uh, work. Like, uh, because I heard it was good money. Yeah. And, uh, and it works pretty chill. No pun intended. Brother does that. Yeah, your brother does. It's a hot profession. I would hope it wouldn't be. Oh well, no! I, or no? I, I guess it would be heating and air conditioning, uh, and ventilation. Ventilation too, huh? That's cool. Heating, ventilation, air conditioning. It's important, especially especially in Nevada, where where if you don't have air conditioning, you're basically turbo fucked. Come on. Can that, can that be a brand? The Turbo Fuck Controller? Turbo Fuck Controller. By Bad Dragon. <laughs> uh oh. Uh oh. People, people like their products, Bad Dragon. Can't be that bad. It's expensive, but. But if you want, if you want something that's like non standard, you go to Bad Dragon. So you know what? <laughs> Speaking of uh, of toys, you, you, Critical has like chart. What? What am I? What am I looking at? Oh, that's the Joker. That's that somebody dressed up as the Joker looking at mouse. Yeah. At, at, at furry bosom mouse pads with like Bara Dakimakura in the background. <laughs> mm, I see. Yes. <laughs> Love there to be just like a take on the Joker where instead of. Being like a dangerous menace to society, he was just he was just interested in like uh, in like subcultures that would be considered taboo, and that's the worst thing he does. Batman, just, what about the Joker? Oh, he's harmless. He's just he's an online troll. That's why he's the Joker. Keep thinking about like what if Joker was a good guy? He'd basically just be like a like a dude who trolls like bad people. Yeah. Just so like he'd be one of those like uh, one of those scam call YouTubers. Yeah. It's just hello. Which would be now easier listen, to you know like on the left will sink the ship. Press this button. 
if you press this button, all these people will die. But if you don't, then then I will take all your money from you. And he presses it. He's like, it's like, oh, congratulations! You just told everybody else on that ship that you would kill them, and I still took your money. <laughs> Although you know, uh, if you were to if you were to call, it wouldn't be the you would be the jester. Yeah. I just I I just jest. Okay, let's try this again. It's just a joke, man. It's just a prank. It's, the, it's just a prank, bro. The pranker. <laughs> the prankster. Luigi wins by doing absolutely nothing. Shit, the red. Oh, I wonder if this channel's done that. If they've lucked out and gotten four of the down or ten of the down balls. Oh. Good question. Oh, there's an oasis to the south, and so the one up top is the harder one. Is Bullet Storm. Okay. Oh, I get to play Bullet Storm. Yeah. <laughs> Apparently, uh, uh, to promote Bullet Storm, uh, people who pre-ordered Bullet Storm, Sonic the Plumber, whoever sent like raw meat. Huh. <laughs> yeah, I know, right? Was it edible? This is an old level. That um, was... it was sent by mail, so oh, no. Yeah, good point. This is an old level that was easy enough to be snuck in. I didn't really have a good place to put it, so it's just here in the oasis. Yeah, it's the oasis level. Because it's pretty easy. Maybe. I don't remember how easy this level was. That's not how that works. It was a loop de loop jack, oh, yeah, that's like right. Sanic. Gimmick level. You got pictures of three musketeers on the wall? Uh. Like the candy bar. What? Oh, yeah. Yeah, it's my dad's uh, picture. Currently staying in your uh, dad's old workstation. Yeah, which is in studio. Which is it was just something he did for editing, and it's a storage. Um, so that's done music stuff in the past, right? He's still doing music stuff. He uh, he's been working on uh, pieces uh, recently. He's been having a, a fun time with it. Oh yeah, that's right. This. I think I've done this level in the past. Yeah, probably. Again, it's an older one. It's an easier one. What? Wait, what? It's a Sonic level. It's all about multiple routes. Oh yeah, you're right. Man, Luigi needs a spin dash. I tried, uh, just having run out of games to play, I tried Sonic 4 again. <laughs> How'd that work out? Uh, I like, I like a lot of the ideas, it's just the, they made it so slow and yeah. sluggish. Have you tried Sonic Mania yet? I haven't yet. You should, you should try that, maybe, maybe you'll enjoy that better. I'm than... sure I will. Apparently, uh, Episode 4, or so Sonic 4 Episode 2 is better. Like, they fixed the engine, speed it up. Surely, like, the level design and everything is fine. It's really just that it's so slow as it kills it. I forgot what I'm supposed to do here. Oh. Yeah. Okay, I get it now. Well. It's, uh, actually kind of difficult to replicate the Eggman fight in Mario Maker. Yeah. So this, uh, this world has two bosses, then. Yeah. Whew. Oh, the last world had two bosses. They were uh... friends. Okay, cool. Unfortunately, if, uh... If I, I, had, I had, like, uh, someone else... I wanted to have, like, uh, the chain chomp attached to a Koopa car. Yeah. But there was, A, no way to do that, and B, as soon as you hit, like, a boom boom in a Koopa car, he jumps out. Hmm. Well, Eggman is tougher than that, amazingly enough. Eggman for Smash? 
Bowser and Eggman tag team against Mario and Sonic can be the best. What the fuck? That's a, that Maui head? You know, Egypt. Egypt. I guess that's like a Mario Land 2 thing. Desert Dash. This is this another repurposed level? No, this is a new one. Okay. Oh! You added it. You added a. Uh, you added one of these levels. A speed run. Yeah. But they added these uh, dash pads. Shoot. And I couldn't find a whole lot of use for them other than speed run. Yeah. I guess you want to have a section where, like, the player is forced to not wait and be patient. How uh... Oh my god, this... I hope this level's generous! It's not, isn't it? No, it's generous. Alright. Again, the campaign is designed to be on the easier side. Despite... Some of the... Some of the levels. Mr. Bones. Oh, hey. What was the other level you spent a while on? I guess the pyramid level? A little bit. Oh, not really. Okay. Yeah, that was that was on the easier side. That could have that could have been really dickish, but the reason why Luigi has to run like that is because otherwise the sun will get him. Yeah, you can't see it; it's just off screen. You didn't have a you didn't have an angry sun in any of these levels. Uh, no. Fucking the trend. Ping Pong Palace. He does appear in the Sky World. Ah. Uh, spoilers. I get it. Almost made a terrible mistake. Best. Best kind of dickery. Self-inflicted. Pachinko is in. That's how we're gonna make all our money now. Remember in, uh... In fucking, uh... Trey... What was the fucking... It was, uh... I believe, uh... Oh, what was it? Ghost in the Shell, where the they did have enough processing power to do something, so they ran it through the brains of old men playing pachinko. They do that? Yeah, they did that. I mean, they're not using much of theirs. They can spare it. That's kind of a jab at pachinko players. Yeah. Remember when Pachinko was a big part of Maizani Koku? Yeah. That's just a Japanese culture thing. Especially for poor people who can win groceries. Yeah, that's... that's kind of exploitive. Gotcha, gotcha gaming. More acceptable in Japan than it is in the States. Yeah. Japan, it's just like, oh, it's just whatever, you get lucky, and then in the US, it's just like, fuck you for doing this, it's... It's not a loot box, it's our EBT program. <laughs> it's... That's some scummy shit, right? <laughs> yeah. I mean, it's not any more exploitative than really any gambling is. Uh, for my gambling, to be honest, I shouldn't be doing this. I need to get up there. You could uh, run jump is enough height. Yeah. Boss level? Is this the boss? Boss! I knew it! Oh. Remember when I said the power-ups got to be a liability? Oh, yeah. 
I should just I should just fight her normally. Let's fight like gentle people. You think people ship uh, Windy Koopa and Mario? Some some someone somewhere? It's not standard, right? Fanfiction.net. Go, go for it. What was her name in the Mario 3 cartoon? It was like Cutie Pie Koopa or Cutie something. Cutie Pie Koopa. Cutie Pie. Oh, wow! <laughs> I killed her, but I hit the switch accidentally. I wonder if, if Mario has a cartoons and games entry. Check. Probably not, though. Probably not. People don't like to remember the cartoon despite it being not terrible. Super Smash Brothers. Yeah, there's always been Super Smash Brothers fan fiction. Obviously. The Super Brothers Sword and Sorcery. Super Brothers. Super Cigarette Brothers. Super Duper Brothers. Maple Story has 1.3 thousand. Mario has 10.7 thousand. 10.7? 10.7. Mushroom High, the Mario characters go to high school. Okay, yeah, that that is to be expected. If there's a popular series, yeah, let's, let's throw them into fucking high school. Why not? Paper Mario Sticker Star AU Fic. AU? Alternate Universe, what if Paper Star, what if Sticker Star was a good game? Peach and the Chipettes interview Wendy O. Koopa. The Chipettes? Wendy the O. Koopa's happy little feet. <laughs> Did you put him rated on there? No, uh, maybe, I don't know. It's just it's just Wendy Koopa is all I searched. A short, exactly 250 word flash fiction story of Wendy O. Koopa's love for dancing. Oh, okay. Murder mystery at Hotel Mario. Gotta not fight for your right to Koopa Party. Get a job, Wendy Koopa. <laughs> it's broke. <laughs> Mario High School. It, Another a, one. a different one. Another one. When Wendy Koopa gets to high school, what will happen? Oh, so she's the main character in this Mario High School. People like Wendy Koopa, man, because she's a female Koopa, and we. The mysterious scent. Ice World. Still World Six. You kept that. That's enough fan fiction for Abide now. Abide the slide. Oh, is this is one you did before? Yeah, it's an old one. Still the most popular. Fucked up. You tweak this at all before you put it in this level? Nope. Okay. Come on! <laughs> Abide the slide. Uh, you, act you actually don't have to press left or right at any point in this level. You can just keep ducking and jump. Keep forgetting that. Well, I don't know how many people know that. I think a lot of them d never try. Well, aside from the very beginning. Yeah. Starting and moving through the pipes, but other than that... It's not preventing you from doing it. It's not like there's any kind of disadvantage. I mean, it's not technically a speedrun level since you got a lot of time. But yeah. I think someone labeled it speedrun. Well, I found out there was a way to a uh, lock tag so that people can't edit them. And, uh, B, I apparently had comments turned off for the longest time. Oh. I, I didn't realize this. <laughs> Got stabbed by icicles. I am dead. Reverse slide! How did I screw that up? Did I jump? Is that why? Or did I not jump? Oh, you did jump. Uh, don't jump. Got it. There we go.
All the love. This is this is a breather level because yeah. I try. I put arrows whenever you actually have to do anything. Yeah. I fucked up. Live from a live bonanza. Live from Icicle Mountain. It's Saturday Night Live. Featuring Luigi, a Goomba, live via Skype, Rod Stewart, Ganondorf, Ganondorf guest hosting Saturday Night Live. That means you have to be in one of the skits. Not like, I mean, uh, did, do you remember the, the, the Japan special event outfits? I showed where they did. It was like a Japanese pop idol designed pop idol outfits for all these Nintendo characters. I don't think I saw that. That's and, uh, that sounds that's like where, something I have to remember. That's where that one, uh, that one image of like Toon Zelda in casual wear came from. Oh. And there's also Bowser looking like a Japanese game show host with like polka dots and a bow tie. <laughs> pop and win. Now we play a game called Free Price. Is there, a, is there a way to fail this? You just don't hit A? And I then... guess. I, I've never seen someone fail it. I don't know what happens. Alright, what's the ultra hard one? It's not even. This is probably the easiest optional hard level. Level so nice we did it twice. Oh! I think I've done this one. Yeah. I'm pretty sure you've done all but maybe the uh, all but the last hard route level. Alright. Well, I made a. I'll be sure to do that one then when we get to it. The original World 8 hard level was, uh. A Kaizo level. Ah. I made one of those to mess with Trog, who just, like, blitzes through all our levels and gets the speed run on every one. Yeah. I don't know if he ever beat it. Finally made a level he couldn't beat. Fight the snowmen! But, uh, after, like, three people streamed the world, I figured the, the joke had been done. So, so I replaced it. it with a, a different, also very difficult level, but not Kaizo. I'm glad the snowballs can't hurt you. Oh, hello. <gasps> I didn't know you could do that! You can also, if you're on ground, if you're on snowy ground, you can pull up snowballs. Ah! Which I didn't realize when I made this level, otherwise it would have made it a uh, mechanic. They look so sad when you get Maybe when you make them. a sequel to uh, Super Fourth Seat World. Super Fourth Seat World 2, The Quickening. You can, you can only have one Super World uploaded, is the thing. Oh, really? Yeah. That's That sucks. You can save multiple ones, but, uh... I mean, a Super World is at max 40 levels. Oh. And uh, you only have, like, 100 level slots to save. Oh, yeah. I did, I did make a level using the snowball mechanic after this one, though. Okay. So this one is just kind of like the introduction to the world and doing a different mechanic, and then later and then later you actually do more like, are like, hey, it would be cool to make a level featuring snowballs. Damn it. Well, I did, I did use the, the spikes that throw snowballs in this. These Goombas respawn. No, they don't. There's only one that you didn't kill. Just hanging out in there. Well, I'm killing it now. I'm, ki I'm wasting a lot of fucking time. The old levels all pretty much have 500 timers, whereas the new ones are uh, 300. Killing the clouds. They're so sad to be disappearing. Like how they get like, oh no! What a world! Oh, I'm still affected by wind. Oh, god damn it. Do you think being Super Mario Bros. 2 is like uh, windproof? That was an idea for a level that I haven't gotten around yet. Windproof? Yet. No, uh, you start as uh, Mario 1 Mario, then you uh, level up to Mario 2 Mario. 
and then you go even further beyond. <laughs> and I don't know, you become the big 2x2 two two Mario or something. You become Fire Mario! <laughs> Damn! That sucks. Without a bender, water will not flow. Earth will not move. But fire is alive. Dangerous. That was, uh, that was when he met, uh... Zhong Zhong. Yeah, the... Who was also, I think, some kind of celebrity voice, but I don't remember who. Zhong. That was... The, it was, uh... Uh, Alec Baldwin, the... <laughs> yeah, go on. The actor who replaced Mako made a post on Twitter. Of, yeah. Uh, like, hey, I found an I found a new potential income stream. I, I can post weddings as I roll. Is that? Damn it! I was joking, obviously. Well, I mean, people would probably go for it. Yeah. If you just, just dress up as like a as like a firebender. I like that Iroh just, just just ended up chilling in the spirit world after, uh, like, I don't know, did he die, or was he just, did he just like, oh, it's almost oh, so my time to go, I'm just gonna stay here. I, I'm pretty sure that's it. After my worldly business was done. He became a Jedi ghost. A force ghost. Korra! Korra had, you think Korra had better development than Rey? The, oh, yeah. Well, yeah. I, well, I can't... Can't From what I've Star heard, Wars. but I haven't seen new yeah. Star Wars, so I haven't seen any Star Wars except Episode Four. You haven't even seen the prequels. Nope. Yeah, but you think you'd have a better time with the prequels? I, I don't know. They look fun to laugh at. They're pretty. They're pretty insane. I like. I like stuff that's interesting, not stuff that's like just competent. I'm also happy just knowing them through proxy of Weird Al. Nope. Oh, I died so close. Damn it. We have made it through the ice bridge. This was a long level. Wow. I had a lot of ice gimmicks. Has no one cleared it? There was no... Oh, I had to re-upload the what that one. That's right. I like how the snowman turns into Luigi when Luigi clears the level. <laughs> I never noticed that before. That's cool. Forest? Ice forest? Ice forest. Is it even a thing? It's a tundra. Chittering tundra. Alright, let's do this. Oh yeah, good, good move. Oh, this is new, right? So, it is, yes. Give me a second. I haven't, I haven't uh, played around with this mechanic. I haven't played around with Wingsuit Luigi. Was this even in the original? The original game, yeah. Not the original New Super Mario Brothers. I think it was in the Wii U one? Wait! Okay, I get it now. I can only do it once, though. Alright. Okay, I, got I, like, it. I like how you knew that you didn't know how it worked, but you still chose to test it off land. Well, I got 22 lives. I'm. <laughs> whatever. I'm a pack to the 1%. I can afford life insurance. <laughs> oh, wow, that's. I like how this works. But once he does the jump, he can't glide again. Yeah, you just kind of. I understand, because that's that's kind of how a wingsuit works in real life. Games with good wingsuits, uh, Just Cause 3. Uh, what else? Have, what other games have wingsuits? Uh, probably like a Legend of Korra game. They had them in that. Oh, uh, yeah. Except that, that is airbending, so that's kind of cheating. Yeah, it, there was a there was a Korra game that was done by Platinum. I have that on uh, on Steam. I haven't played it. It's first time for everything. Although if you're playing a Platinum game, I should be playing be playing a Platinum game. We've got Metal Gear Rising. Is it really a Platinum game? It is a Platinum game. Yeah. It's actually really subdued. Uh, 
Was it? Is it uh, like its own original story? Is it based on? Yeah, I think it's its own original story. story. Uh, from what I heard, the, the consensus is that it's fine. I was picturing like a uh, Kuvira era with a bunch of Earth, Earth Nazis. Oh, Earth fascists. Earth soldiers, yeah. You don't have to be a Nazi to be a fascist. No. I thought I could save it. How far back am I? Have I been? Uh, you just got wrong? a checkpoint. All right. Go on Super Luigi. It's odd how they roll. Not a lot of the uh, like second stage power ups move that way. I guess it's the only one. All right. Good. Okay, I get it. That's good. I like I like this. Glide is the name of a character in Mega Man Legends. Yeah. And he's like an asshole. Yeah. Which is why he's yeah, he's, uh, he's much nicer in Battle Network. Yeah. He's uh, not, uh, I think he's like a rival sky pirate or something to Tron Bon. Oh. Uh, you know, because Tron Bon's in like a nice enough uh, gal or something. What the fuck? Okay. That was fun. Good, good use of the wingsuit. I know like that's a, not what it's called, but flying squirrel suit, I think. Yeah. She's like a tri-tagonist, isn't she? Tronbon. Tri-tagonist. Yeah. Like a, a third-party uh, tertiary tagonist. All right. Next one. It is ship to the sky. Yoshi! Oh, wait, that's, that's it. He's just there. Bye, Yoshi. Up. I hope that's Yoshi's only appearance in this, uh, in this, uh, oh. Hey, I got one. Got the other one. Uh. I see how it is. Wait, hold on. What? Okay, no, I don't. I don't understand. Why are those doors there? It's hard ice. You can't melt it with fire. Oh, seriously? Okay, why? Only, only the frozen coins are, are fire meltable. Nope. Ah, shit. Uh, that was one that I didn't want to go. No oh, shit. I'll have to try again anyway. <laughs> Please tell me that this is the only time Yoshi shows up in this uh, it, it's, it's hard to come up with unique ways to enter an airship, okay? <laughs> no, it, it's just funny that, like, Yoshi only shows up one time and it's just... the hell's there to throw you up? The cameo. I only need one of them. Why well, I need I at least one of them. Hey, right here. Oh, oh. Fuck! Yeah. Alright, come on. I oh, only got one of them! Okay. Nope. The worst possible luck. Oh. Don't think you can get in. Come on! I made it through. Gauntlet of shit. <laughs> Just 
Thanos is slow enough to shit cover hand and grenade. Oh, oh. goddammit! Why'd I die there? It was easy! Instead of the checkpoints this time. You're barely. You, know, you passed one obstacle. <laughs> it was a tough obstacle. I'll leave one of you. One. Uh oh. Well, <laughs> let's try that again. Oh, that, that's not wh where I wanted them to go. Okay, cool. I made it. Back down to one hit. Oh. What? I tried climbing it! No, you can't climb on those. Damn! You tricked me! It does look like you could, I don't blame you. It's, it's good. It's a good trap! There's two. There's two Yoshis. Yosh. 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 Going high. I wonder, you can set the Smash Brothers language to multiple languages, I think. I wonder if Smash, how much English Smash Sonic has in Japanese. Oh, I, I hope a lot. Because apparently he does that throughout, like, all of his appearances in Japan. It's not just Sonic X. Just he speaks, he speaks English. Yeah. He just it's, like, it's, like, English it's like if, it, it's like if so, there's, like, a hero in, uh, in America who just dr drops random Spanish. Ronma does that in Japanese. What, Spanish? No, no, not, not Spanish, but... English. Not not as much as Sonic, but every now and again it goes, Thank you! Thank you! I just gotta take the hit. Did I do that? There you go. If I had fire, then it would have been easier. Oh, oh no! Oh, you want fire! I can't, oh. I can't jump. The ice is too slippery. So this level is hard. You did, you did yourself. All right, world six, man. Right. How bullshit was it in Mario three, in the in the sky world, when you got kill them all? Shit, you got the airship. And it would uh, float down to the other half of the world. And just slide under there. Yeah, that's what I'm gonna do. Yes! Then you have to go through the whole Tower of Babel again to get to the other side. Yeah, that would. that sucked. I don't remember if that happened to us. I only recently remembered we did do Mario 3. Yeah. We did, was it a right? No, it was. we teamed up. Yeah. Do it. That's another randomizer we could do if we ever really wanted to. Was there a Mario 3 randomizer? Yeah, awesome. Okay, so I can't use fire, or I'm, or I'm gonna be asking for trouble. Yeah. And make it double. Prepare for trouble. Team Rocket, motherfucker. Fanfic or Ash joins Team Rocket? I'm sure. Ash is like, I, I, I agree with your... Oh no! Ludwig von Koopa. Proud. Ash joined, joined Team Rocket, sort of. <laughs> sort of? Wait. How's that work? Sort of. Uh oh. Power ups become a liability. You should get more damage for, like, ground pounding on them. It doesn't, though. Oh. Ash joins Horrible Team Rocket. Horrible Team Rocket. In which Ash is mean to Team Rocket. <laughs> what, is he, what is he not? Bad Ash. What if Ash was a punk kid who joined Team Rocket? <laughs> And the, and the thumbnail is just James with Ash photoshopped over his face. Is that what that is? I thought that's just, like, somebody just... <laughs> unless, that it's, photo unless it's like a dream sequence from the show, I don't know. T 
Team Rocket's advice. Misty and Ash get some advice from Team Rocket. Sometimes they can really help. Catch and win! Let's try this again. Come on. Oh, there's audio cues! Yeah. Ah, oh, shit. a bad idea. We had an episode of that. Yeah, he just, he won. So the bottom is rainbows and sunshine. We've done that one before. Yeah, that's an old, probably the oldest one in here. Yeah. This one is... Cloud Clamor. Nice. Was this called the Hustle Theme? I, I don't, is it? Athletic. Uh, athletic, that's athletic yeah. The song has been ruined for so many people. Why, because it's just called Athletic? No, are, are you not familiar with the meme video? Uh, It's no. for the best. Okay. It's like, it's, it's for the best if you don't hear Baby Shark. Might as well not ruin it for you, too. Just like how people say that, like, fucking the Anne Frank, uh, Dragon Ball Z crossover was the worst thing ever invented. The worst thing humanity ever produced. And that sounds a little excessive. That's a bit excessive. That sounds like someone who doesn't read fan fiction. If that's the worst they know. Fucking, I, I, I can name, I can name right now a, a, a fan fiction, uh, Dragon Ball Z fan fiction specifically that's worse than fucking, uh, uh, the Red String of Fate fan fiction. Me too. Is it the one where Frieza fucks Bulma? No, that's not bad. That's just that's just. It's a bit dark, but no. Um, let, let me just tell you the title. Oh, okay. Oh. <laughs> I want to make sure I get her. I want to make sure I get her name correct because I I suddenly uh, the name uh, Videl, right? Yeah. How Videl discovers her abortion fetish. Oh. Okay. Yeah. Uh, yeah, that's pretty bad. That's that you want to talk about a worse fucking fan fiction. Speed. I need speed. Speed, speed. is key. Speed is need. Ed. Speed is rice. Oh, you, you want to make sure your rice is just speedy. Uh, come on. <laughs> That's a problem. It's a little annoying with those pipes. I always appreciate it when power up when you have a section level where power ups are necessary. Yeah. Makes it makes power ups mean more than in base game. I didn't make that one very long because I don't really like the super leaf. I can I can make the super leaf work. I'm more a fan of the cake. Cape's got some good mechanics. I like the wingsuit. Yeah. Wingsuit, this wingsuit's pretty good. Very versatile. Yeah. Skylane. Alright, which one's this one? What's this gimmick of this one? Here's the sun! Oh. This is also called Jeffrey Athletic or... me. Yeah, this is the Mario World Athletic theme. Yeah. <laughs> Get juked! It's zigged and I zagged. The, Mar the new Super Mario Brothers son doesn't look angry enough. It just looks like a, a Mayan decoration. Yeah. What is the Super Mario 3? Oh no, that the sun doesn't exist in 3D World, does it? Uh, I don't remember. I don't think it does. It's kind of bizarre that they finished all the major updates and uh, 3D World is just by itself in that little cut-off set of styles. Yeah, because it's too, it's too dissimilar. It's the only special style in the category special styles. That oh, I can't do- plural. Sorry, I can't do that anymore. This isn't- Only Mario World. Or Mario Rumpack. 
Sun's kind of just there. Yeah, it's impotent. Oh, I hope I didn't need to, do, to use that for anything. Are those threats or are they useful? Yeah, they're threats. Do I drop here? Oh, the arrow wants you to go up. Okay. Yeah, this sun's really not a... Th In general, the sun's really not a threat because it doesn't ever go anywhere near you if He's you're just standing still. Yeah, it's only on platforming levels where you're going pretty low to the ground. Also, these platforms are weird. Because in Mario World, you didn't walk on the grass parts. No, in this one you do. It's bizarre. Hey, guy! Hey! Hey, Hiroki! Yeah? Yeah, what's what's up? Isn't it weird that they don't like walk on the grass parts? Well, I mean, do you stand on top of the grass? Well, no, but... What, what if the grass is, like, frozen? Hiroki, you're a genius! I gotta get the timing really good. Ah, okay, I almost got it too good. This is your best interpretation of the claws of claw swinging yet. Yeah. Here we go. Utilization. Yeah. Utilization interpretation. Well, I believe the claw swinging is something like this. It's an abstract concept. You, you remember that uh, that gigantic uh, bundle for racial justice? Yeah. Well, apparently, there's a, a free game engine included in that. I want to try playing with that a little bit. Yeah. Maybe one day I'll participate in the in Ludnum Dare. Ludnum? Ludnum Dare? Is that how that, that's pronounced? I don't know, what is it? It's a game jam. Ah. There's some pretty interesting stuff uh, that comes out of uh, LD. Junior's airship. We fought all the Koopalings, we're all out. Did we fight all of them? Yep, because two, two of them were in an arena together. Uh. Uh-oh. <laughs> Fuck up, door. <laughs> How'd you do that? I just... He drifted. <laughs> Here, I'll get up on the rainbow. I forgot you could stand on that. Okay, there we go. I wish you could set how long, how long clouds last. Can't. Unfortunately, you cannot. They're kind of short-lived. Gotta refresh them a lot. Ow. Oh, hey, I can just... Bombing run! Oh, damn it. Okay, whatever. Well, you still got bombs. They moved. I guess Mario 3 is what started the athletic themes. Yeah. And Mario World, Yoshi's Island, they all had them. Yeah. It, Mario 2 only had the one overworld theme, Mario USA. Da, 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 da. That was kind of it. Da, 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 da. What would a Super Mario World 2 athletic theme be like? Put the Super Mario World 2 theme through the through Muse through the Muse software, and then there you generate an athletic theme. Mario Brothers 2? Yeah. Super Mario USA and then put that through the, uh... You know how, uh, Miyamoto considered World to not be a complete game? Did he not? Oh. I, I, I suppose. I wonder if part of that was the weird way the, uh, the Star Zone worked. Because it wasn't like Warp Zones in previous Mario games where you would, uh, unlock the next area. You could only use it to get to Bowser. Yeah. Is that why he considers it? It's like the star zones are unfinished. It's unplayable. Oh, I don't know. I don't think he's gone into any explicit detail. Cool, I made it. Okay, this level's kind of tricky. Miyamoto, Mario World, unfinished. It's It's raw. Anti-air! Okay, cool. I forgot, I didn't, I didn't realize that was there.
Alright, I'm in the airship. Huzzah! More cloud stuff. And it's an auto scroller. I mean, he considers it unfinished, but a lot of people didn't play this game anyway and go, man, this game feels unfinished. Because I've seen and played, like, games that felt unfinished or, like, there's something missing. I just fucked myself. Maybe. Yeah, I fucked myself. I would say... I guess it... Do you think it felt shorter than Mario 3? No! No, not, not at all. I, th I felt like it was comparative length. It was definitely easier, but levels, that's mostly because of the ability to save. Yeah. The levels, um... The, lo the Super Mario World levels felt longer. And I think there were as many levels in World as there were in 3. Oh yeah, 3 definitely had shorter levels. So I would say, I would say, and that's not counting the secret levels, the uh, ultra-hard bonus levels that very few people remember. So, in all honesty, I would actually say that, uh... That, that world is the longer game. So, I don't know, for what it's worth. Fucking mad- these fucking magic Koopas are just all up in my shit. Oh, shit, my- Alright, I'm on the next one. I like how you, you, you made an effort to make sure that all of the, uh... Well, I wanted to... All the levels are, are different. They're not, like, a copy of each other. Yeah. And I didn't see a checkpoint, so... Unfortunately, I did not have, uh, an abundance of checkpoints here. Yeah, so you gotta... You only have one per sub... Gotta take the elevator up. Per sub area. I didn't have quite as many uh, jumping platforms originally, but the cloud just ran out too damn soon. Yeah, if you could make the cloud infinite, that would be nice. Or maybe just even use the P, the P power up again. The balloon. Yeah, that'd be nice. I want, I wanted to do a Lakitu cloud level. Yeah. It's interesting, just, because it's like I'm playing a game and I'm getting the de developer commentary as I'm doing it. It's just that I realized the thing ran out after designing this entire length. Yeah, is that why you designed it, it, this next part kind of like this? Uh, no, this was already this way. But it, do it does help out for the final stretch. Yeah. It's a good thing this this part doesn't last long because you could easily. Alright. Oh yeah, the shells just get just get fucking toasted. Uh-oh. As I figured he was easy enough that it wouldn't be the end of the world if there wasn't a checkpoint. I couldn't. I did it. And I would have had to have a pipe to another area. So you killed all of them. You killed my son. You stole his Koopa cart. Yeah. Which is better than a Lakitu cloud, at least. Yeah, they don't run out. Lakitu is it, so that just tells me that the Lakitus make like propel, like have the magic to keep their clouds afloat. And if you steal them, they don't last very long because there's no. Maybe they're continuously producing cloud. <laughs> Where from? That's up to the imagination. Magic, obviously. Magic. It's not like magic does is like a rare thing in this universe. They have hammer space. They have a, in, in their hammer space, they also have a magic fog machine. So there is a story. There's a two level story where you steal the. Uh, yes, you you take the lack you, you take the Lakitu's cloud to get to Bowser Jr. to take his car to get to Bowser because it lasts longer. It's better. Shit, flat cannon towers. 
Step night night mission. <laughs> Was that supposed to happen? I I knew it could happen if you happen to get uh, these balls moving forward. Oh, if they don't have anywhere to land. Okay. How are they so slow? This doesn't make a sense. How how uh how knowledgeable do you think Luigi is outside of like business sense? Um, is he like a is he science minded? Uh. A philosopher, maybe? He's like... Wasn't that the, the like, Luigi Mansion speedrun guy? Yeah, that was, his, that was his uh, interpretation of... Hey, give me my car back! Oh, he's still alive! So just avoid him? Uh, yeah, you, you don't need to kill him. Okay. So he's, uh, he hijacked a Lakitu cloud. He's pissed. Yeah, clearly. I had this level going, the scroll going faster, but the night theme makes... Your cart so slow. Oh, that you were just stuck to the back wall. You couldn't move <laughs> oh, forward. Oh shit! I'll tell your dad I said hi. This was a cool addition when they added this. Yeah, good. This was a, I think, Mario Maker 1 update. Final car. I wonder if anyone's still playing that. If there are like one or two holdouts. Like, Mario Maker 2 ruined it. I'm gonna play one till the day I die. You know, you know you fucked up on a sequel if uh, people would prefer you play the original. Apparently, there's this game I like called uh, Curious Expedition, and then they, they make the guys announce that oh we're uh, we're doing a sequel, Curious Expedition two, and from, from what I from what it sounds like, people don't really like it so far. I mean, it's still in uh, early access, so that could change. But people are like, oh, this lacks the charm of the original. I'm proud to present the Calling Two. <laughs> then they're doing Calling Origins. <laughs> Zero players. Yeah. And did you hear what they're doing? They did with the uh, that one. Calling business. Origins was the one where they were going to have one free game per day, right? Yeah, and then how can you continue to fuck up that badly? They did. It's it's like comically. It's not like EA. It's comically bad. Come on. Uh, that also happened with uh, Worms World Party. Oh what? It just wasn't enough new stuff after Armageddon. And Armageddon already had such a big community that people didn't bother to migrate. Yeah, that's what I heard. Also, there were uh, fans hatching features into Armageddon. Yeah. So a lot of the stuff that was added in World Party would eventually just come via fan mods in Armageddon. Yeah. And you know what? Team 17 acknowledged it and they continue to support uh, Armageddon in, some, in one way or another. Well, they actually, I think they just let the fans do it. Yeah. Which is a good thing. The fans are... They care enough to continue updating the game with new features. Team 17, they're really chill developers. Yeah. Wish more developers were like them. I don't like that every new Worms game since has been very samey, but I do like that they let the fans do their thing. That's nice. Yeah. I mean, if you want a casual experience, you get one type of game. If you want something more hardcore, you get this other type of game. Nothing wrong with that. There's really no way to stop no these. Longer. Oh. Why didn't I think of that? Did you ever watch uh, Falling Down? Or do you know anything about it? I don't know what that is. It's a movie uh, where this dude is having a really bad day, I guess. And finally he's just like, I've got to protect my rights as a consumer. Yeah. And uh, eventually he's just like... Got it. He's just like this cop pers uh, like pursues him because the crimes he's doing uh, are very weird, yeah. and, uh, and that's the reason he pursues him. So let me guess, he stole your baseball bat, but he paid for the soda. And uh, well, it's it's weird. And then finally, he confronts him. He's like, "Dude, you've been doing a lot of really bad shit." The guy goes, "I'm the bad guy. How'd that happen?" Because <laughs> for his perspective, he's just he's just trying to get home, and all these people won't let him get home. I love that movie. 
proceed. Going home! Clear a path, you motherfuckers! See where kids teaching them how to like operate. Oh god, you're back! <laughs> Panic jump. <laughs> <laughs> there's, there's a scene where kids teaching them how to like operate a fucking like uh like rocket launcher it's like yeah you're supposed to get this up there oh okay yeah what movie are you filming huh yeah you, you, you're filming a movie right what's it called he's just happy to make it up he's like oh under construction yeah. and it's just like it's just like I would like to watch a movie about a dude who's just Who's like pissed up, fed up with construction workers, and that's basically what falling down is. It's just a guy fed up with everyday life instead of just construction workers. Yeah. Hey Arnold, the movie. They're gonna bulldoze the neighborhood tree. We gotta stop the construction workers. Isn't that Hey Arnold, the movie where they, where Helga and Arnold finally officially get together? I think they like or am maybe, I wrong? maybe kiss at least. I don't remember. Helga is a Sundari, right? Yeah. Yeah. The most Sundari American cartoon character. Yeah. Helga... Because you know what? She's honest about her. I love you, and I hate you, and I love you, and I hate you! Helga Bukowski? I, I forget her last name. Helga Bukowski? Helga Kickbuttski? I, I knew it. I'm just drawing a blank. Hey, Arnold Helga. Hey, Helga. Helga Pataki. Pataki? It's almost, that's almost Japanese. Is the tritagonist and overall main antagonist of Hey Arnold. The o overall. That's that's a little much, <laughs> you think? <laughs> main antagonist. She's not the main antagonist, she's just a character. Harold was more antagonistic than Helda. There, that show really... You know what? There were, like, uh, like adult figures that were corrupt as hell that were more of an antagonist than fucking Helga. Though I could be wrong. That was a cool grandpa character. Yeah, Grandpa Arnold. So I'm, uh, also, wasn't that another one like, uh, like Scootaloo? Arnold's parents were like Indiana Jones explorers. Yeah, <laughs> that's the second time that happened. That was necessary. Except in that one, it was revealed that like his parents were lost. Yeah, not dead, just lost. We don't know oh. where they went. You know what was a great uh, episode where uh, where Arnold is like having to fight uh, a dude who lives in the sewer called the Sewer King. Yeah, just like King of the Sewer. I like most of the best episodes revolved around the Asian fellow. I forget his name. Uh, there was one where he became a country singer. One where you learn about his tragic past, where he like left his daughter in his original country. I think of Asian. I, the first thing I thought of was the was the dog from fucking or the Asian dude from fucking Kurt's Cowardly Dog. Watch where you're going, you Watch fool! Watch where you're going, you fool! And then he later, it turned out he was like some mechanical wizard. I why, did it again! Why are you keep doing that? Oh no! <laughs> I, I, <laughs> I just... Mr. Hewn. Hewn? Yeah. That's the guy's name? Or which guy? Hey Arnold or or Courage? No, Hey Arnold. Yeah, wasn't the other guy Wap Fu? Alright, what am I? That guy. Oh yeah. He was uh, one of the very few residents of the the boarding house. Very few which is I guess an apartment building? Boarding house? They, they called it a boarding house in the show. Maybe that's what the place was called, the boarding house. When it was actually like an apartment building. Suggested based on your recent search activity. Boarding house, hey Arnold. <laughs> was it a boarding house or was it something else? This gauntlet is kind of is kind of difficult, but I'm getting used to it. Boarding house is a house in which lodges rent one or more rooms for one or more nights, sometimes for extended periods of weeks, months, or years. That's just a hotel. It, what the fuck? Or a less committal apartment building. It's just halfway between. But people there live for, like, long periods at a time. Or for a single night, I guess. Can you imagine someone renting an apartment for one day? They go through all the setup and shit. 
well, then in that case, they have to get out of town quickly because the law, because either the law or the criminals are after them, right? Yeah. Keep thinking that the that the fucking projectiles are gonna block my shots, but I keep being wrong. Sandy with the Bob Ross Kappa. Is that new? I don't know. Is that something we added? No, that's not something we added. Uh, I just updated the Twitch emotes with uh, we have two Dar Darian drawings. There's a, a dead Zelrog, an Angry Jack, uh, Pinkus! <sighs> that almost was bad. Does Shadow like one of them? Uh, Shadow is not one. Oh. We got Eggman. They, they're bit rewards, so they get expensive after a point. Uh -huh. We're actually only able to add so many at this point. Alright, don't jump! Yeah. You don't just fly past him. You don't suck even need it. to acknowledge him. No, fuck it. Hey, give me my car back! No. I'll punch you in the face. What else did we have? There's a durian. There's still a world after this. What's left? Oh, I can't. I forget. I forgot that. Well, we climbed an ice mountain to get into the sky. Where Space. We then we then went to raid Bowser's uh, Junior's airship to then raid Bowser's spaceship. And, and you said this game didn't have this world didn't have a story. As, as much as one is, is is possible in a Mario Maker world. Are you really going for the coins? No, I'm trying to kill him. You almost got lucky. It's gonna be easier with the. Uh... Oh, Walter and Pog Broly. Ah, Pog Broly. I hear Pog Broly and I can't help but think of like fat ass, bold, <laughs> white, white girl Broly. Well, it's something that is so obscure that no one else is gonna want, is gonna lay like, claim to. Yeah. That weird knockoff Broly. <laughs> cool. I, I gotta check if someone died there. <laughs> <laughs> Somebody died there, Debbie. We did it! To space! We go to space. This is the only hard route with a new level. Alright, well, let's check it out first. Hard route first. So we fight Bowser again? Is that what I'm where, where I'm getting at? Snowball fight. I tried to employ every uh, boss in the game oh. that is programmed. Okay, I get it now. I see. I think I remember what boss. Oh, whoops. Alright. After this, uh, we should take a look at whoops, too. That's the only one I kind of want to get you on stream outside the super world. <laughs> and you don't even have to finish it. At <laughs> that kind of level, huh? Huh. A lot of, there's Snowballs. a lot of traction. Oh, shit. Snowballs can't hurt you. No, that's not what I was... I was, like, thinking, wow, there's a lot of traction. No ice mechanics. Imagine if, my, if uh, Mario 2 Luigi played like Mario 2 Luigi. How much worse this would be. <laughs> Oh, I could just do that. Yeah. It's a fake Burgo. Or I could just do this. Get out of here. Let's just leave. So, you, you remember that 70s show? Yeah. Well, uh, the guy actor who was, uh, who was Red, the, the stern father in, uh, in that 70s show, Actually, he was in RoboCop as well. Oh, okay. As who? As a fixer. As, like, some criminal. Okay. It was so weird. He he went in, he was like, there was a scene where, like, uh, this one dude, he was, like, going to kill this one dude, and this one dude was, like, with a whole bunch of, uh, like, women. And, uh, and he's turned the women, and he just went, Bitches, leave! It's just... <laughs> but the way he said it, it was... <laughs> Come on! Hold down. 
Oh yeah, that's right. That's I forgot that that was a game mechanic. It didn't come up until just now. Oh god. Okay, come on. You remember getting over it? Oh yeah. Uh, not, was... not relevant to this level. Just, just bringing it up for fun. Still, still a good game. It's still. I actually saw. You know. You remember I was talking about those uh, those idol VTubers. Uh, there's one a, a girl by the name of Bikora, and she's like, I'm going to, I'm going to challenge myself. Thirty minutes. I'll give myself. I think it was like thirty minutes or an hour to complete. Uh, to complete uh, getting over it. And and she's actually doing pretty well. But then she made a big mistake towards like the middle, towards like the church, and she's like, I can't complete it. She's all sad. And there was a timer going down, right? I, I know, I gotta, I gotta do the super jump on the snowball. Uh, and, uh, and when the timer went to the very end, you were expecting, I was nobody was expecting it, but there was an alarm, and the alarm was basically just this big explosion, and it deafened the viewers, yeah. and it scared her, just like, <laughs> That was just, I just thought that that was funny. Just a BOOM! <laughs> Kirkwood Smith. Kirkwood Smith is the actor who is the fixer in Robocop. Oh. That's the guy's name? Yeah. Alright. Zelrog, this level is buns. Is that good or bad? Go for some nice buns. Mm. Maybe, maybe you should watch uh, Great uh, British Bake Off. <laughs> they make buns there. Like, imagine a cooking show, except everything's pretty chill. Yeah. The Bob Frost of cooking shows. In that they both... It'd be like a Swedish show, the Bake Off. Yeah, except this is British. Even the Harsh Judge, you know, because every cooking show has to have, like, a Harsh Judge. Yeah. Even the Harsh Judge is pretty is pretty nice, all things considered. My mom disagrees. She's like, nah. She, he's pretty mean. I'm like, dude, I've seen a, guy, a show where a dude doesn't taste the food and just and just tosses it in the garbage and insults the dude. All things considered, he could be a lot worse. I'm having trouble with this level, but it's not killing me, so. This is one of the levels I made after the after the Super World. One of the more difficult ones. It's pretty difficult. It's that's, not Kaizo. That's bad, only because I'm bad at it. Okay, thanks, Truck. Oh, a level Trog can't beat? Say it ain't so. What the fuck? Um, okay. What? What's confusing you? I'm trying to get up here. Okay. I can just barely get up here. Don't fall. No shit. Okay. Font! Damn it! <laughs> Nothing to do with getting over it. Oh, is this is this what you meant by getting over it? This is your this, getting over it? This level is basically that. <laughs> getting you know getting over it didn't have a time limit. Yeah. Unfortunately no avoiding that. Yeah, unlike unless you're a fucking rabbit VTuber. Someone made a uh I think the people Got him. I think the same people who made that uh that Animal Crossing fake update with all the stuff that everyone's been asking for in the game. Oh, somebody did that? God damn it. Yeah, like all, all the quality of life features people have been complaining about. Like, why can't you do this? Why can't you do that? And someone modded them all into the game and made a fake Nintendo Switch promotion. <laughs> I think Nintendo took it down. No shit, they took it down. There is mis- There is- God damn it. But the point we came across, like, hey, yeah. Nintendo, why aren't you doing this? And I, I actually don't know if it was the same people, but someone made a fake Mario Maker 2 updates. Some of which were obviously troll stuff, like Lakitu can throw anything. That would be so good if that happened. But a lot of them were, like, really useful features. Maybe, maybe abusable. An infinite time limit was one. Infinite time limit would be nice, but... Oh my god! This one's difficult! Gotta have appropriate scaling difficulty, Luigi. Do, do I have to finish this? No, you don't have to. But there's the whole third section you haven't gotten to yet. Oh no, really? 
Imagine how much fun that is. Finally! Alright. You can just run jump. It's okay. Climb. Climb. Shit. I missed my opportunity multiple times. How do we pog yet? Yeah, this this level's difficult. I had to clear this in oh, 500 I... seconds. <sighs> well, at least the guys don't respawn. Oh, this one I... You didn't kill any of the guys. No, I didn't. I'll let you in on some cheese. What? You can, uh, that previous one, you can send a snowball rolling and jump through the thing real quick. Oh, this... okay. Well... Hmm. You don't seem to understand what I mean. I know what you mean, but... Is there a checkpoint after this? Uh, yes, at the end of this cave section. Alright, well, let's do it! Climb! Shit! <laughs> it's okay, as long as you don't fall all the way down. <laughs> You're good! Got three seconds. Made it! Yeah, I ate it. <sighs> Alright. Right. Don't even try. I'm I'm I don't trust this level to be kind. Don't you. trust any level. I always picture Steve Austin saying saying that as if like he did that himself, but I then it, but I realize that the alternative is that uh, is that he got hit and then he grabs the mic afterwards like don't trust anybody. So, oh, I don't know why you're trying to do this in one form, but it's very bold of you. That didn't work out. <laughs> Wait, I didn't think this through. Come on. Wait, can I throw snowballs at them? Oh yeah, okay, I can. You can I actually off the mushrooms. Yeah. I saw you. Do I saw you doing that. What? Not you. I'm talking to the. Snowball cannon. Alright. Oh, that's right. I missed. Finally. Uh oh. Uh oh. Now do it again. Got it. Yeah, I couldn't do this in 30 seconds. <gasps> <laughs> There's three of them. Multiple hit points. Snow block. Yeah. Imagine Bowser's so bored he's paying his minions to have a snowball fight with Luigi. I, I like the concept that this is Luigi's first, uh... His first adventure? Yeah, it's solo. This is his proving... This is the proving ground. Wasn't, uh, Super uh -oh. Luigi, like, way harder than Super Mario? Oh, uh, Super Mario we Yeah. Supposedly. Yep, I need it. <laughs> I don't need it. I don't need it. I need it. Gotcha. You. This is a fair hard level. Yeah. I, this is just like. That's what I strive for. Yeah. Three lives left. If I die, then I'm gonna... I'm gonna move on. That's it. You've seen all the level. You saw the ending. You just need to get to the... Through the gauntlet. 
with the two mushroom. Yeah. Which is why this this snowball cannons are good because you don't. It actually makes the the two work because you don't lose it. You don't lose it when you get hit, but you, you could lose your life. <laughs> It's like Ganondorf's boot. <laughs> so, uh, I, you know, I've been working through story ideas a whole lot, right? And I, yeah. and I realized that I really like uh, stuff with like really awesome characters just fighting each other, which is where the, the idea for Tournament Arc came in. But you're, uh, you mentioned that you wanted to do Tournament Arc, and and so I came up with an idea of just like a, like, like if Twin Peaks was an anime, yeah. I call it Dramatic Battle Theater. And it's a town. It's a town known as uh, Theater Wa Theater Washington, and it's where like all these like strange and colorful characters with crazy abilities live, and then they just fight like people who are just fucking with their town. How do I do that? I have no idea how I managed to make that work. Yeah. Find an egg over the ocean, Mario! <sighs> well, that was that certainly was an experience. You've cleared what is probably the hardest level in the world. It, in, in the super world. Okay. That's a... I got bragging rights. It used to be harder. That, that's where the Kaizo one used to be. <laughs> I like that the World 8 is like the cloud world. Star Road. So it should be smooth sailing from here. Yeah, let's open the window. Right, so we're almost done. Oh, let's look. It's fine. We're, we've been pretty quiet. I doubt the neighbors would complain. I've I'm never not got... worried about the neighbors. I'm worried about outside noise picking up on the microphone. Oh, yeah. Yeah, you're right. Can't use my... Oh, what? Oh! Moon, moon gravity. Okay. I'm like, okay, can I make it? It no. kind of has to be an auto-scroller in order for the Magikoopas destroying blocks to be any threat. Otherwise, you can just run past everything too quickly. Yeah, that's that's what we call speedrunning. Mario on the moon. Or Luigi on the moon. Or plumbers on the moon. Is that the latest? That's the latest Death... That's like one of the Death Grip albums. In words on the moon. Yeah. Uh, for a second, I misheard it as innards on the moon. In <laughs> That's a Death Clock album. <laughs> this is Death Clock covering fucking. Uh... No, that was part one of a of an album. Part two was Jimmy Death, and that out the bar with both parts of the album were called The Powers That Be. Death Clock. Uh, Death Clock. Death Grip. Death Grips like their two parters. Uh. Well, you, you mentioned the death heated. Death heat. I wanted. I need it. Death heated. Yeah. Responsibilities. Cool. I know. Okay. We that, that wasn't a two-parter. We made a joke about it being a two-parter. Death melted was the sequel. <laughs> the two, the only two-parter I know of is uh, the the sequel to Boom I Fucked Your Boyfriend, which is Smell Your Dick. <laughs> Uh, that's a different song. Yeah, yeah, boom, I fucked your boyfriend. Oh, that leads into Smell Your Dick? Yeah, which is which is where I'm like, yeah, the woman, because the woman found out about it. Oh. That's, that was the joke. <laughs> I, I don't have the Smell Your Dick song, but I do have the first one, and it's probably the worst song on my iPod. D Daniel Taj uh, did a, did a uh, web redemption for the woman who did the Smell Your Dick song. Yeah. I didn't see that one. No. Well, that's probably why you don't know the song, then. I'm familiar with it. Uh, Robot Chicken parodied it. <laughs> did they? Instead of, uh, instead of Daisy, they had a, a sketch where Hal sings it. Can oh, I you... smell your dick? <laughs> and I'd then, like to and sing a song for you. I'd like that, Hal. It's called Smell Your Dick. Uh, why you come in? Did you see that? That's pretty much exactly the skit, what we just did. <laughs> I, you know what? I would love if, if the, if he, she, if uh, Hal was like singing that, and then the guy was still just doing his fucking thing, just with, a, just expressionless. Yeah. I find it funnier if people just don't react to, to crazy stuff happening. 
or some people do. It depends on this on the context, I guess. I'm jumping, I'm jumping way too fucking early. It depends on the context, but I think it'd be I think in certain situations, if you're doing a parody of something, then what about the opposite, where uh, Sashomaru just never makes any expressions, but everyone knows how he's feeling? That that's that's great. Like, can't you see how happy Lord Sashomaru is? Just like stare. Uh, hey, hey, how do you Sushomaru really feel that strongly, Lord Sashomaru? Blank stare. <laughs> well, shit. I guess we better do it. Oh, you did it again. I did it again. I wish you didn't make this an auto scroller, but here we are. It'd be too easy otherwise. Sonic as a mechanic, as a game. There should be a Sonic maker. Why didn't Why didn't Sega jump on that shit? Because Sega doesn't know good ideas. Uh, they know good music for the most part. Yeah. Oh, hey, little shit. <laughs> you said you said oh, it's a fine song, but you you I guess you changed your mind on that. No, no, it is, the chorus is very goofy. The lyrics because <laughs> he's not a super villain. But it's, the song composition is fine, and everything but besides that... How can that, it be a song about a supervillain? Some of the lyrics say, Heroes rise again! The rest of the lyrics, like, describe Shadow pretty well, though. Yeah, destroy anything that isn't your friend. Just because he's out for himself. He's a, he's a loner. The loner. But he's not real. Well, I mean... What, what was his story in Season 3 again? I don't even remember. Was I, he hanging with Eggman? He was... I guess? I don't know. For Shadow, Shadow in, in Sonic X was really chill, for the he most didn't part. not much. Yeah. Which works for a character like that. Yeah. That's, it worked for Shishomaru. That's why Shishomaru is like a good character, because he's... He's got Rin and Jokin as his hype men. Yeah, he, Rin and Jokin emote for him. They're a better, they're a better, more interesting team to watch than the main characters most of the time. S well, because it's not because they're because they actually uh -oh. <laughs> good save. <laughs> what was I? They're fucking... actually they're actually they actually get along much better than like the protagonists. Amazingly enough, it's Takahashi series, so I guess that's not that amazing. Oh, well, whatever. Ah, as long, once I once I slowed down, this level became much easier. Because I wasn't just, like, hugging the wall. WHERE'S THE PLATFORM? OH NO! Thanks, Trog. 150. Did you make that level specifically a spike, Trog? No. Oh. No, I'm gonna that, pretend that you was, said yes. That was the other level. Oh. Which is called Trial for Trog. It's above the sky. It's all boomers. Always was. <laughs> Nice. Good, good mechanic. Boomers. Boomer Aang. Is, is, that what, is that what Aang is called in Korra? Wait, hold on. What the fuck am I doing? I don't understand. Well, there were coins there to kind of guide you. Do I jump down? Uh, pro no, there's nowhere to land if you jump down, so you probably don't want to do that. I can't aim the boomerangs. No, but they will return to you. Oh, I get it now. Let's try that again. I get it now. There we go. Last pipe here and it doesn't do shit. Uh oh. This section's uh wait, what? Wait, do I have to lose it? No! I get it now! There you go. I'm like, why is that fucking blast pipe there? And then oh okay. Two ways to use glass pipes, Luigi. Thank you for not immediately jumping in. Oh, good. I, 
this is I'm i I'm not like tiring down from a stream. That's good. That's a good sign. Yeah. Oh. Super Mario Maker World is uh, oh, is done and dusted. This and two castles. Two castles? Yeah. Okay. There's a super secret final castle. I take it. One of them is uh, one of them is another level. Oh. Okay. <laughs> I gotta get my boomerang. <laughs> Link never, Link never loses his weapons in Smash Brothers. How come K. Rule does? That's not fair. K. Rule loses his weapons. Yeah, he throws his crown, and if he doesn't catch it, it just sits there. Remember? Because the crown is one of a kind. Yeah. It'd be like if Link threw his master sword. But, I don't know but why. the boomerang is like a key item. There's only one in the whole world. We can't buy them in shops. The boomerang's magic. Are what those banded termina? Because you can't buy any in shops. You can buy shields. Hello, you need for self defense. I don't know. That was swamp. That swamp woman was selling a was selling a pretty nice sword. Yeah, but we know her backstory. We know where she comes from. Black market. I'm I'm just a nice old Gerudo lady. Nothing suspicious here. No! They're so useless if you have any kind of ammunition. They're just generally way less of a threat than they were in Mario 64. Yeah, because in Mario 64, Mario couldn't, like, fucking... Alright, so... I'm safe here. I wish I could fucking... Oh, shit. <laughs> I thought I was being clever, and I was, but... I thought he actually rose up a second time before uh, going down. I guess not. <laughs> good, good cool beans, dude. You ever been negative land? Uh, in... Mario One Glitch? No, uh, it's a it's a group, the a band, I guess. I have not. They, I guess they're ar arguably a band. Uh, they, they do music. Is it arguably music? It's it's totally music, but there's no it's spoken word with mu with music. Um, uh, taken from uh, other stuff. Um. 
So I gotta show you something. Or they just talk over sample music. Uh, no, they you no, know, they don't. They don't do it. They they have other samples talk over music oh, is that they produce sample? themselves. Okay, they produce the music and they have a uh, sample the. Uh, what did I do recently? I think one of the obscure Timo Toki solo project stuff, separate from Stradivarius. He had a track that was just like, uh, it was music, but with the entire Charlie Chaplin speech from The Great Dictator. Oh, what? That, 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 that's, oh yeah, the one where he's like saying, I prefer if we all get along. One of like the two movies Charlie Chaplin spoke in. Yeah, it was kind of like that, and, and it's very, depending on the, on the, on the song and what the song's about, it, it varies. Like there's one track called, uh, Pour It On The Fourth Of July. Where this woman was like, is like yelling, "You don't retweet my, we tweet my fucking, you don't share on Facebook, but you don't want to help in somebody." I guess it's from a video of some of her. My favorite one is one called "Mounting the Puppy," where this uh, this CEO dude is like saying, "We also have this tradition called mounting the puppy," and it's just like we engineer our company to promote happiness. Is it the a Japanese CEO? No, it's he has a vague accent. People love that. Those are the best kinds of accents. I have a feeling he's a, he sounds Asian, but I could be wrong. Uh, storm the castle. You like Link? Oh, hey! <gasps> yeah, let's do it. That didn't work. I'm gonna try that again. Let's start from the very beginning. Oh, you thought of that. Can't be that easy. Oh. It, okay. it rolled off around the top of the buzzy shell and began rolling, affected by gravity. You could do it, Link. There we go. That's how that works. I thought that there was a... I thought that, that there was an arrow. Uh, shoulder button. Okay, that's... that. I figured. I don't think you can... Can you move an arrow? You can aim it upwards. Oh, you can just jump. Yeah, arrows arc. That's why they're called archers. Well, you, you can jump an arrow, you just can't uh, walk while you're holding it. Yeah, and, again, I, and I immediately prove you wrong. Oh, you can walk. Yeah. Okay, that's what I was trying to ask. Got him. Oh, you're behind a wall, huh? I think you played this one. Have I? Maybe. It seems familiar, but... Oh. I got it. I always want to do down B for bombs, and I end up doing the sword dash because well, of Smash Bros. Sense. I like how uh, Link's Master Sword is able to just get into the dead. Mario can't, Mario can beat the shit out of skeletons with double reform. I think the only thing it doesn't kill is the ghosts. They can strafe. Oh shit. Hold on, I'll be back. You know you don't have to fight everything. Why give me the fucking Master Sword if... Oh, he pursued me. I bet you can't jump on him when he's spiked. You should be able to as Link with his sword. Yeah. Doing the down Just do the down stab. Maybe you can. Damn it. Just keep going, man. I'm... Let's just storm the castle. Have fun storming the castle! Well, there's only, there's only so many things so that you can't, like, uh, rush through all of them without fighting any. You think it'll work? It'll take a mirror, though. Actually, you can if you follow a very specific path, but... had to uh, re-upload some some levels because uh, just like soft locks or exploits and things were found. Poor 
Frog got a uh, really good boss RNG on this, and I had to re-upload it, and he just lost his time. <laughs> yeah, the new category, old percent. So, like, are the ghosts just not affected by anything? The that ghosts are not affected by anything. Maybe bomb explosions, but probably not. Probably not. Oh, okay, that works. I got that by complete accident. Okay, I get it now. I should have tried to see if the shield would deflect that big ass thing, but. I think you can still jump up there. <laughs> that... <laughs> Turned the wrong fucking direction. Let me see if this works. Like how fucking Chopper hides in, uh... The opposite direction. Yeah. There's some weird gags in One Piece. Yeah, well, makes it memorable. Hey, a raccoon dog! I'm a tinnit. I'm a reindeer. Talked about in the Discord there how, uh... I guess after some hiatus is, is, is uh... Toei is A, continuing One Piece, and B, continuing... A Digimon Adventure remake that I didn't know existed? Yeah, it's cool. So yeah, I guess they remade Digimon Whoa! Adventure. Whoa! <laughs> that surprised me. I'm like, oh, it's a platform. Oh, shit, it's springy. I'll New lives. This. I'll get this. I like how when he's skidding to a stop, his shield just kind of drags behind him. Fuck it, I'll do it the slow way. Got plenty of time. Although you, I, I take it you intended for the shield to be the uh, optimal. Optimal, yeah. yeah. There you go. Castle. Luigi, you're not making any sense. What happened on your adventure? Uh, somebody helped me. It was amazing, Mario. I was a Hylian. I had a sword. I like to think of it as just, uh, Luigi hires Link to help him. Yeah. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> Alright, let's try it. Dumber than the time that you played grass. Wait, what? <laughs> played grass? What was that about? It was in uh, Paper Mario. Remember Luigi had his story going on? Oh, yeah. He had a flower party member. He had a, a buzzy beetle mechanic he pissed off. Yeah. He, he burned that one uh, blooper. Yeah. Like, you fucker. This is like the this is the second time we fought Bowser. This guy is just This guy's unbelievable. Well yeah, you got a sword and a shield this time though. There we go, got him. <laughs> Damn it! Oh, I got him though. Can I block the fire? Yes. Cool. Die, monster. You don't belong in this one. Oh, that's one way to do it. Were you? Which one were you expecting? Uh, if you reflected their, uh, balls, they could roll under and hit him from beneath. Oh. Uh, is that, the, is that, was that the intended strat? You could blow up the underside with bombs. No, this works too. Oh, oh for fuck's sake! Like the best bosses, there are multiple ways to attack this foe. The best Zelda bosses. Wait, hold on. Can I just... Mm. 
technically. Rain of arrow arrows. Or blot out the sun. Oh, he hates that. <laughs> what is the that? arrows? Is that the Ganon hurt sound? I think. I don't remember. The sword does the most damage. It's uh oh. Uh -oh. <laughs> Why? No, don't hurt me. <laughs> That's risky. I'm not gonna do that again. I'm just gonna use bombs. I'm gonna blow the shit uh, out, up, up, out of him. I think the balls are the fastest way. I would guess. Alright, fine. We'll do it the fast way. Mom, Buzzy. I can't jump and defend! That was the first time I'd seen someone uh, go in from the top like that, though. So kudos for creativity. Well, she was better. I only need one of them. All it takes is one. I did! Wrong way! Kill me? Yes, no problem. Okay. Oh. Yeah, a little peaky hole. It's not enough, though. What's the timer on these bombs? Oh, we can only have one out at a time. <laughs> can you upstab? No. Oh. Not a thing. Drat. Yeah. You throw a bomb up in there with him. That was risky. I, I'm trying to... Anyway. No, that didn't work. Retreating! Abort! I think I had to re-upload this because there was a soft lock where you could uh, get, like, stuck. Yeah. After the after this area. Okay, if I'm here, then he's not gonna seem to be safe. Bombs. Well, I can't wait to bomb Ganon. Hold on, I got it. You gotta cook him. Pipe is a lie, it doesn't go anywhere. Okay, I'm. Fuck! Fuck! Bowser! You see why Trog was so happy to get good Bowser RNG? Trog. It's a dynamic. It's a dynamic and interesting boss battle. It is. It is pretty fun to just kind of be like, okay, I gotta get this guy out. What? How am I gonna do that? Uh, I'm just gonna fire arrows at him. If Jeff Goldblum were in Star Wars, what role would he have? Uh, he'd be, he'd be a weird uh, alien. That sounds about right. He'd I was thinking like a shitty bumbling Jedi. No, but <laughs> bumbling Jedi. The Jedi don't have cool names. Uh, Mace Windu. I mean, they just go by their birth names. They don't get uh, nicknames like a Sith do. No. Darth Vader. Life. Life. I am. I am Life Jones. Life Yagami. Don't. Uh, yeah. Don't go through there. That's the reset door. Why would you need a reset door? In case you get through to the other side and you can't jump back up. And, and you, don't, you have, don't have the key. Ah, uh, makes sense. Oh, damn it. Final okay. castle, one life. It's golden. Mm -hmm. It's fine, I'll die and I'll get five more lives. Because I'll be reincarnated. Let's see, it'll be like an Isekai series. That's how you game the system. 
So that that was the outer wall of the of the castle. So is this next one new? Uh, yes. All right, cool. This is the final one. And I'm guessing this is gonna be a. Uh... Yeah, it is. That's what I figured. Technical boss battle. <laughs> Whoa! What the fuck? This is where I shoved all those other wearables that aren't the Goomba hat. How does this mechanic work? It's exactly like the propeller hat, but you get three jumps. Okay, all right. We'll make that. I'll make that work. Oh, Trog got penis. Shake your Wii remote to spin. Of course, of course. Yeah, good thing we don't have to fucking do that. I remember having to do that. Motion controls are good for, like, party games, but they're less fun for, like... Are they good for party games? Are party games not really better without them? Oh, Jesus! How dare you! A lot of speed doing that. Uh, yeah. That's disappointing. I imagine it you could be slow to a fucking a stall. I'm not gonna make it. Okay, I am. I see it now. Hold on. Hold on. Can I? That, oh, no. no. That didn't work. That didn't. That didn't work at Using all. Using the shoulder button immediately spins you. You That's lose the so... long jump. So you don't have a long jump, but you gain three three midair jumps. Okay. Any fox in Mario Maker. So I'm gonna I'm gonna say without a doubt you made the best uh, like Luigi game. Yeah. You just made you didn't make because you didn't make a fucking gimmicky game. You just made a fucking Super Mario World game. That's just. That just happens to have Luigi in it. Well, I mean, because we're playing as Luigi, but... I imagine you had Luigi in mind when you were developing this game. Ah, uh, no, not necessarily. Come on, man! Yes, yeah, so totally a Luigi campaign. All Luigi, all the time. Damn it. Luigi saves the princess. Luigi saves Daisy. As compared to, uh... The game... The, the multiple games where he is in a, in a mansion... And the one game where, uh... He's trying to get rich? Again, more rich. Wait, what? 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 Ha how does New Louis? It's just a harder version of regular New Super Mario Bros. Yeah, yeah, and uh, one person is playing Navi. Oh my God! You can long jump once you lose it. <laughs> yeah, thank you for that. I mean, if you were like rushing across and got a long jump in at the last second, maybe you could. You've saved the hardest level for last. Well, it's not as hard as the snowball one. I don't think. time you usually eat? Like six? About. They, uh, oh, cook. Uh, Your dad is an uh, accomplished cook. Yes. A chef, I should say. Cook it's something chef. different. Retired. Uh, a little less prestige with cook. It's much happier uh, with cooking now that, now that he's uh, not doing it professionally anymore. Yeah. He's able to watch cooking shows again before he just dreaded doing that. I know he's had some uh, <gasps> not so great employers. Okay, you can only do it three times. Oh, how'd that work? We just snuck under. Oh, <laughs> oh gosh! <laughs> That's not how that. Uh oh. Did I fuck up? Okay, no, I didn't. Now I fucked up. Safety net. You found the weapons room. So just double jump. Yes. How long does it last? A while. I, yeah. like, I like this edition, it's a cool new edition. That's so cool. I like that, actually. Jetpack... Super jetpack mode. Alright, this one. Cannon mode! What 
would be uh, what would be the setting for a Mario 2 athletic theme? Because it, it has like different styles that Musenet tries to emulate, like jazz. Jazz, yeah. Bluegrass. You just do. Uh, here's what, how you do it. You just do the initial bars, the da 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 da, da and then you set it to. Uh... I'm doing uh, three variants of every song I put in. Right. I'll keep that in mind when I when I work it. And I'm trying to make them go as long as I can. The... There's kind of a limit oh, wow. to how long it will uh, generate them. Yeah. I understand. No! Go away! It took Sandy so long to figure out to just jump over the bully. Again, the thing of, if you make a level based around an ability, you have to account for it being a power-up. Yeah, just supply infinite of them. Okay, good. Damage gain. Bugger. Hey, a boom boom! Oh, ninja! It's Pom Pom. Sorry, Pom Pom. Who is, who is only in 3D World style. You can't have her in the other game modes. Yeah, understandable. Oh, oh. oh my! Okay, whatever. I like that. I like that old Bill power up a whole lot. Cannon's, Cannon's also pretty decent. Yeah. Triple jump, I can see doing a climb level in that style. Kind of linear. There's not a whole lot of ways to use that. The bullet bill could make for its own like type of level. I got I got a storyline for this finally. Yeah. Mario was finally murdered by by Bowser. Oh, this is the Luigi Revenge Quest. Yes. This is uh. What was that, the name of that one uh, old school uh, VGDC Rise of the Mushroom Kingdom? I think that was it. Yeah. Yeah. It ended up being that like uh, Warp did it. Warp, but it's okay because enemy. because because uh, they went back in time to stop it. Fucking hell! This is difficult. And was it was it Mario died or Luigi died? Mario died. It was a, a Luigi revenge quest. Yeah. Him and uh, and a bunch of people. I, I, I hate 3D World Boom Boom and his stupid arms. Yeah, his arms have long fucking disjointments. <laughs> Go invisible. <laughs> I, oh, I thought I was gonna fucking bite it there. I need to kill both of them, don't I? Yes. Alright. You gotta kill whole families. You can't leave one alive. That's cruel, Jack. I like this. I like this. Uh, this world. So, if you figured out ROM hacking tools, you'd probably be a fucking wizard at it. Oh, I'm sure I could do something fun. I have trouble. I have a blank canvas issue. Here we go. I might. Oh, cool! Wait! Have fun! I have to ram him? You have to propel yourself forci forcibly into Bowser. Wait, huh? Oh, he got killed he by got a block! He got teleported! You cheese the shit out of him. <laughs> Never seen that happen before. <laughs> Good job! Speedrun strats. I want to kill you. You're already dead. Explodes. <laughs> Is that it? That's it. Wow. Big discovery. Trog thanks you. <laughs> Good. So all you speedrunners out there. <laughs> Some out to 25. But what about Mario? 
Mario would have wanted us to continue on. He wants you to be happy, princess. So, so that means I can marry Link? If you want. I've seen that. You've seen that artist, right? The, you've mentioned the Peach yeah. and Link one, yeah. Yeah. Did a lot of them. Go out to the uh, uploaded courses. Yeah. There's a uh, Whoops 2 is the one I wanted to show you. And if you want to look at it, the tr uh, Trog Kaizo one is a little lower. I think I'm gonna be sick, Luigi. I didn't see who cleared it. Was Sandy still the only one? Skylandia. Alright. Trog's cheer shared rewards to three others in chat. You can do that? Guess so. Cool. sideways again. Is this based on a specific level, or is it, uh... This is based on the, you remember the whoops, sideways Mario? Yeah, I know, but is this based on... No. Is this like, okay. No, it was original. Because people kept, uh, people responded to whoops by not flipping it, and just tr jumping down in trial and error. Oh. So I made one where you have to flip it. Hmm. Interesting strategy. <laughs> Alright, let's try that again. You discovered the super secret bonus level. So I mentioned uh, my concept dramatic battle theater. I'm basically making characters by by look, by thinking of my favorite characters and being like, well, change them a little bit, and I have them there. Yeah. I'm basically making the characters as if I'm like booking a pro wrestling promotion. I'm like taking my dream team of like characters and having it be in the same. Also, just concepts that are in my head, like a order of magical girls, except one of them turned evil, and they're and instead of being like Sailor Moon, oh, we'll name the moon, we'll just do our one move. No, they're actually, like, really powerful mages and shit. As well as, uh, other... The fuck? Okay. Oh, down here. Alright. The climb. Oh, I have to. Not good enough. Of course, it's not. <laughs> I think I've got a ceiling fan, and it's really quiet. Oh yeah, I didn't even notice till you pointed it out. There you go. That's how. That's how good it is. Has a setting higher, but then it starts making noise, and I have a feeling that if I set it for high for too long, then it's gonna just come apart. I had a ceiling fan when I was a teenager. Yeah, did it come apart? It fell on me. There you go! While I was sleeping one night, <laughs> I woke up and the, the ceiling fan was like sitting on top of me. The fuck? You didn't notice it? I, I, I assume it woke me up. <laughs> so you weren't hurt by it? No. The ceiling was just uh, slightly too weak for a fan of that caliber. Was was the house like old? I don't think so. It was the house that uh, the one I grew up in. Where oh, that one. My sister is now living. Well, no, that's a good, that's a good house. Optimistic. It's, I I'm, I'm just I'm just uh, prodding this level at this point since I don't have to worry about lives. This is a puzzle level. Yeah. Yeah. I nice. like how the Mario 1 dry bones are just sands. <laughs> <laughs> so I have characters that are based off of uh, Corrin. Yeah. Is it, he's a martial arts cat. Yeah. Just li just... And then, uh... There's a character based off of Gandorf. He runs the hotel, and he also does novels with himself on it, like Fabio. Okay. And also a strong wizard martial artist. That's a lot of hobbies. Yeah. All, all the characters in there are like it. 
Everybody, and the general rule of thumb is that anybody who lives in the town, not is it has unique it has unique powers and can also fight. And uh, uh, another pipe. Okay, yeah, but I went down there and I ended up going back to where I was. Did I not? I guess not. Oh, what's down here? You chuckled, didn't you? No. Wait, what the fuck? Where am I now? The other half of the level. <laughs> did I miss what? Did I miss just one half? Have a good evening. Uh, evening. All right. See you later, Trog. See you, Trog. Thank you for the bits. Thanks for watching. How long have we been going? Uh, I don't, we can't see Ob, so I don't know. Oh man. It doesn't doesn't Twitch say? Oh yeah, three forty. Three only three? I thought we were going for six hours. No. Shit. I I still I feel like I can go another three hours. We're gonna we're gonna have dinner soonish. Yeah. Alright, yeah, down here. I almost died there, but I died here. So you need to get an on-off switch before you can go up that way. And enter the pipe. You have my permission to finish this level at any time, by the way. I don't expect you to complete it, honestly. Yeah. <laughs> this is this is very complicated. It's, uh, it's a different kind of level than what I was playing. Is there anything else you want to show me? Uh, you can look at the trog one if you want to. Yeah, let's see. Where is it? Uh, down further. Broken Legs Mario Returned. It's much harder and more bullshit. I don't recommend it. <laughs> My string of very difficult levels after the campaign. Bog bop by you. Further down. There it is. No one has cleared it yet. See, I dare you. Speed run level, okay. Holding the buttons down. Oh. I. What? <laughs> Okay, I have to immediately jump. Yeah, it's one of those levels. Oh. I have to spin jump. It took me a few days of continuous attempts to upload this. I have no idea how to do this. It's just an immediate spin jump. <laughs> I just wanted to show it off. Yeah. Oh, because I gotta hit this thing and then the. You have to jump on the falling spiny. Yes. <sighs> yeah. All right, we done. Yeah, I'm done. I'll I'll see if I'll see if, I'll see Trog doing this. He hasn't. He hasn't finished it. He hasn't. No. <laughs> no, no one has cleared the level. No one. No one except me, obviously. Because it because it took you a few days. How many? Hold on. One thousand one hundred seventy-seven attempts. All by the same person, probably. I don't know. It might be old Trog trying it. Oh. That was fun. I'm gonna swap over to the end screen. Yeah, I'm on it. Yeah. That's, that's, that was fun. Alright. Alright. Linger on here. 20 seconds. Thanks for watching, guys. We plan to be back tomorrow yep. with starting Mario Odyssey. I'm, I'll be playing it, and then afterwards... Uh... There's actually a two-player. It is? Yeah. Huh. Okay. So I, I, I can be cappy. See how that works. If, if it's if it's awful, then we'll just go back to you. <laughs> Probably a portion of the stream we'll be playing solo anyway, just to see how it plays yeah. solo. But uh, that's the plan tomorrow. Thank you guys for hanging out. Yep, and we'll see you tomorrow. Adios. Adios.